I can start the recording again. My guy. I am heckin' craving some gosh dang D&D. Like, you don't even know. Now I'm out of drink. Um, so I was like, right before stream, I was like, I don't want to play Doom. I want to I wanna find something to scratch that itch. You know what I mean? So I decided to go back and uh, I had Divinity Original Sin still installed. Um, and then uh, I was like getting prepared to play it and stuff. And then I remembered like 30 seconds before uh, the <laughs> the stream starting screen was over is this was one of the first games that actually was playing on YouTube. Like when I used to do Twitch and YouTube videos at the, in tandem with each other. And uh, I never finished it. I don't remember why. But I never finished it. So I'm going to go give it another go i have no idea how far i got in the original anymore um oh i remember i was playing with some mods i had like a druid character and i think like a, a necromancer or something uh it was a mod someone made on uh the steam's workshop and they were really 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 fun um but i want to go through the main storyline <laughs> the downside is these are really long games so i may have to commit and play this all the way through so we might be buckling up for 80 plus hours on this game uh but you know what these games are fantastic if you're looking for any sort of DD itch these games are so good number two one of my favorite games I highly recommend it fantastic larian does an amazing job they're re they like really care about their fans and they're an awesome community they they constantly push updates and changes that uh for the game they push massive free changes to their game which is another thing they actually have a built-in D, D creator in uh, original sin 2 um if you guys aren't aware of that um i created a, a one-off with my friends a long time ago in their with their creator and did a little like D, D session through their gm mode mama and it was a blast uh, so that's up on the youtube channel if you guys don't know about it and serial now that you're into D, &D if you want you can go check it out at and laugh at it or don't because i might use that little uh, one-off in a uh, our current campaign but i'm looking forward to this larian is one of my favorite studios they are fantastic they do great work and they're the ones in charge of doing baldur's gate 2 so i am highly looking forward to baldur's gate 2 now that is one of my most anticipated new games coming in the future as soon as that comes out i'm picking it up and we're going <laughs> you're you're feeling some uh D, &D too as well huh also you know what the uh looks like the uh audio changed again let me switch it i wish i wish windows would remember my settings like i switched it to this setting keep it suckers all right but we got it we're gonna do a brand new game all right we're gonna turn it up and I am heckin' excited. This game is really that quiet? I guess I did turn down some of the volume and stuff before starting. We might have to tweak it. It looks pretty low. Hold on. Options, audio. There we go. Stop it, you here! Oh, these didn't or save. I'll box your ear! Hey, stop that. Yeah, these didn't save. There we go. That music, though. All right, that looks a little better. Turn these up. There we go. Let's uh, get into this game. See, I, I turned off the mods, so. Uh, single, and I, these games are multiplayer, which is really cool. Uh, I think I'm going to go to explore mode just so we can finish the game. Oh, man. It feels good to be back. Now, this is going to be interesting because we're going to get... <laughs> this is obviously that comes before Original Sin 2. So I'll get the full story now, hopefully. Excuse me. Boop! Got that nose. The dogs are eating something outside and it's grossing me out. 
All right. Oh, yeah, that was the name of my dude. Nah, Ranger's boring. Rogue, Shadow Blade, Wayfarer, Witch, Wizard, Battle Mage, Cleric, Enchanter, Fighter, Inquisitor, Knight. I like Knights, they're cool. Knights are real cool. She's super cool. I like Inquisitor. Enchanter. Ooh. Cleric, huh? Hmm. Saving throw bodybuilding. Hmm. She looks pretty badass. Battle Mage sounds real fun. Look at that. Touch attack. <laughs> Witches could be cool. Ooh. Hmm. Hmm. Cool. All right, I'm thinking Inquisitor. Just because she looks pretty badass. All right, let's, uh... Let's customize them. It's cool that it uses names that I've used before. Um, okay, what's his personality? Loyal, random, knight, rascal, maniac, judge. Judge? Is it going to tell me what that does? Uh, look at all this lore they have. This is amazing. Loyal random knight. Well, let's give him the judge. That sounds cool. Perhaps I can dead. What can I cook? Look out! I see a trap near. Ah, yeah, I'll give him warrior. Skin Quite color. useful for a war weary blade. Satin sand. Holy crap! The beacons are lit. Gondor calls for aid. You can shine a light at him. You're gonna go blind. That one's worse. That one's worse. Sweet almond. That's what they call me in the streets. Honey glow. Golden touch. All right. We got to change his head. Ooh. Oh, dope. Look at that stash. <laughs> Whoa. Got some battle pain going on here. Ooh. I'm liking that kind of hair. Yo, a fro. Wait. Can I rotate you? Yo, that one's cool. That doesn't look very knightish, though. That looks more uh, barbarian. What the fuck? <laughs> okay, dude. Ooh. Nah. What do you got? That looks pretty knightish. Look at some of these hairstyles. He's like Fabio. All right, where was... That looks pretty dope. Let's give him... Ooh. Yo, he looks awesome. Jet black. Raven's wing. That's cool. Ooh. Ooh. Silver Fox, yo. Wait, he has underwear. There you go. Damn, look at this boy ripped. <laughs> it looks like Fallout 4. I started watching the first episode of, uh, oh, Critical Role. You liking it? They're like five hours long each, man. That's impressive. I needed. These are horrible portraits. They were, you no. Know, he needs blonde hair or silver hair. All right, man at arms. Let's customize him.
encourage allies around you. Immediately heal yourself for a nearby target. Two-handed defense. Reduces chance to receive status. Ooh. Armor rating and minus 20% movement penalty. I don't remember what that means. Man at arm skills. Oh, he's got leadership. Boost initiative and damage. Nice. All right. Um, tax of opportunity. What a rush increases your turn action points and maximum action points by two in your bet out. Ooh. I like Leech. Leech is pretty sweet. Oh, pet pal, damn it. That's like the best skill in both the games. Zombie. That's kind of cool. <laughs> you become stinky. My precious. Every time you hit or get hit, your gear has a 50% chance of not losing durability. Nah. Oh. Right, if you're carrying a lot of stuff, the durability. Maybe I'll get rid of that. Skills. What was it? Defense? Hmm. Twenty percent movement penalty. Maybe uh I don't know. I thought movement penalty is um when uh like you're overburdened. Bully. Bully boosts non magical attacks by fifty percent against opponents with slowed, crippled, or knocked down. That sounds cool. Hmm, I don't like being below 30% life. That's scary. I kind of want to change that to, um, bully. Because this is a knockdown, right? I don't think I have any stats to, um, or other abilities to keep stacking that. Maybe I'll keep it. It is now. Do I want to change my skills? Melee power stance. Increases both damage of your melee attacks and your movement speed at the cost of precision. Minus 20% chance to hit. Minus... 50% less... Or, um... 5% less chance to hit. That sucks. Or, whatever. You know what I mean. Encourage. That used to be a... A skill, or a racial. Or that is a racial in the second one. Divine Light. And decreases target's willpower and body building. Crushing Fist. Ooh, knocks him down. Knocks him down. Ooh, maybe I can switch it here. I forget what the encourage status does. I think it's like in chance to hit. Uh, let's... We're gonna switch this because my brain makes me. There we go. Wait, no, no, no. I think I might keep the cure wounds. That could be nice. Let's do... I might switch to Leech, man. Leech is so good. Let's do Leech. And then we'll do the other one later. Alright, cool. We got Roderick. He looks pretty badass. Alright, let's do Scarlet. Woo! She look fine. Give her Maniac. That sounds awesome. Priest, free spirit. Free spirit sounds pretty cool. Like, she didn't give a fuck. What could that have done? What could that have done? Better to death. Ah, forge. What could that have done? Look out! Careful, I've spotted a trap. 
a whetstone wheel. Now, what do I have that needs sharpening? Have I got any? Look out! I see a trap nearby. Mm. Does this change? Perhaps I can death. There must be a way to spring this trap nope. safely. Okay, let's give her free spirit. Ah, uh, priest sounds cool. Look at that hair, though. Ooh. I like five and six. Yo. Go and kiss. This leaf is just floating there. There it goes. That one's cool. Look at that eyeliner. I think we're going to go with six. Hair one is pretty baller. I don't think anyone's going to challenge that fucking Princess Leia. <laughs> of course they have that. I need to sneeze. <gasps> yeah. Hair one. We're not changing that color. That's dope. Underwear. Get some booty shorts. I need to sneeze. Holy crap. They have like a million more portraits. I just felt that way anyway. Put your clothes back on. There we go. Oh, wait. All right, let's customize her. What are we going to do? Let's do... Yeah, she's got wands, so we might just stick with that. Uh, She's got air, fire, and witchcraft, huh? Hmm... Hmm. No one has lock picking. That's a bummer. Air, fire, and witchcraft. All right, let's keep that for now, but let's see what kind of skills we can do for her. All right. Not many. Kill yourself with life or someone else. Where's the, the Healy one? Ooh, still a damage boost on an ally. Neat. Weakens and curses an ally or enemy. Where's the knockover skill? Teleport. Oh, little leaf was falling in the background of my the game and I thought I was getting or a spider was on my computer. Does bully say stunned? Because that would go great. Jump from one target to another and uh, stunning them and dealing damage. Okay, that's an AoE. I kind of like that. We got for fire. Sets them on fire. Burn my eyes. Temporary perception bonus. No. Maybe I should get a a heal like a regeneration. Hmm. Pop, 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 pop. Do I get rid of the fire one in favor of regen? Kind of leaning that way. What if I do this? What if I get rid of fire and give another one to witchcraft? And, ah! Wrong button. Oh, I can't. Balls. Ooh, increases your saving throws. Floor master. Hmm. That could be helpful. No, don't give her stench. What the hell? That sounds horrible. Elemental affinity. Oh, bummer. Hmm. Increases everyone's attitude but it gives you one extra point in intelligence. That's pretty sweet. One extra use of a wand skill. What? One extra use of a wand skill? Explain.
I'm thinking I'm gonna do hydro and we're gonna give her that uh regen it's pretty sweet but then she only like this is her only use I don't remember how to build characters if you guys can't tell um gives you one extra use of a wand skill oh that's right wands come with skill screw that noise my precious no 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 we're giving her pet pal what am i doing yes yes you get to talk to the animals uh far out man could be good but let's see if there's something better One ooh. Bonus point in blacksmithing and crafting. What a rush could be actually really good. Because if they get dropped about or down to 30%, we get two AP and we could probably get a regen off. That could be worthwhile. Hmm. Why can't you have um opportunist? Oh, because you need man at arms. What is the um, speed creeper? Ooh, that's awesome. Oh, can't be knocked down. That's awesome. Grant you immunity muted. That's pretty dope. Immune to environmental. Your grenades never miss again. 10% chance to evade hits. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, picture of health gives you three, three times man at arms extra vitality. Oh, fuck. These are awesome. Damn it. These are pretty great, man. Glass cannon. Oh, that's what I used to get. Oh, half life though. That's rough. When an opponent lands below that should kill you, come back out one health as long as you had one life left. Oof. That's pretty great. All right. Let's see. I kind of want, um, I don't remember what I want. What was that one I was looking at? Oh yeah, picture of health I was thinking about for a friend. Let's give um I'm gonna give her what a rush. Yo, she looks awesome. Alright, let's check out Roderick. I might get rid of this. In favor of man at arms. Can I do that? Wait, it didn't let me do that, did it? Yeah, I can't do that. Fuck. He spent a long time in character creation, right? Uh. All right, well. Feared, muted, charm, stunned, curse, petrified, decaying, touch, mark of death, remorse, and shackles of pain. I kind of want to up his willpower. Because. Hmm. I'm going to up his willpower. What talent did that give me? That had to give me something. Thick skin. Yo! Extra armor, you your man, man at arms ability. That's dope. Scientist. Pack, mule, precious, lone wolf, light stepper, know it all, five star time, blah, 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 blah. I don't think any of these were the ones I needed it. Slowed, crippled, or knocked down. So it has. Slowed, crippled, or knocked down. Okay. What about. What did I give her? Stunned does not work with his ability. 
so maybe we'll switch thunder jump slowed crippled or knocked down balls why can't it be stunned man that would have been great um balls that's kind of a bummer well I want another slowed crippled or knocked down ability that's what I really want hastened huh that's pretty sweet It's a bummer that freaking stun doesn't work with that. Maybe I will get rid of. His, uh. That talent. Oh, wait, I don't even have it. Never mind. Normal switch smashes your enemy, knocks him down. I'm gonna change this. I might go back to encourage. No, no, melee power stance. What the fuck am I doing? Like, I have a less chance to hit. But I do. I move faster and I do more damage. Encourage would probably be better, but that's zero AP cost, so yes. All right, you guys ready to actually play? I am 30 minutes into the recording and we just finished creating a character. <laughs> Let's go. In the days of old, the sorcerers of Riverlong cured the sick and healed the wounded through a great power called Source. But a terrible darkness invaded the land, and Source was forever tainted. The sorcerers who once healed now only destroy, and madness has overtaken them. A few brave Source hunters are all that stand between Riverlong and the dark power that threatens to destroy it. Wherever Source appears, hunters follow. Hell yeah. The doggo cam is all jacked up. Rise and shine, Master Source Hunter. Tell me what to the do. Come once you up on deck. Yeah, them calls means we're close to shore. I don't ever you're going. I don't there, remember this part. Source hunters. City's full of undead, hungry enough for blood. But you're supposed to investigate that murder, ain't you? They say it's Source that did the counselor in. Source in a city like Sicil, nowhere safe anymore. Here they are, Captain Sir. God's blessings on you, hunters. You'll be happy to hear we've reached Sicil. But there's trouble off. I like that guy. So we'll have to sail in carefully. Here, have a look. Those are orc ships, and they're blocking our passage. We'll get you as close to the city. Those as orc we ships can. look like um Let's drop you off in the beach. From Maelstrom. Now. Orcs are on the attack. Get that booty, get that booty. Closed every route out, and there's a sorcerer on the loose. If we are to get justice for the counselor. Have to keep your wits about you. May the luck of the gods be with you both, source hunters. Yeah, let's go. I do not remember that intro. They're making the band. The Abogies. Get him, get him, get him. Yeah, look at us. Move this so I don't. I didn't move it. Fuck, I dropped it. Uh. There it goes. Alright, so this will go here. This will go here. Ah, I activated it. No, no. 
Ooh, a res scroll. Wait a minute. Staff of Magus. He's not wearing his staff. Get out of here. Flee. We're going to switch that to here. Okay. Scarlet, what do you got here? Head vice. Get your magical claws out. Where did I get that? I don't remember picking that. How come I have so many skills on her? Uh, okay, whatever. Um. Oh, it's left clicks. Okay. Picking excited. What's the... Um, what's the button to see things? Oh, right. There's an attack move action. Oh, no. That sucks. I, um... My button helper disappeared. There's a button to auto. If I didn't pick up, know I there were orc ships raiding to the west, I'd mistake this for a placid beach. At least the orcs make a bit of noise when they attack. It's dark dealing sorcerers that'll strike with neither warning nor mercy. Oh, dead person. Let's go check them out. Ooh, is got that more a corpse? Crimes. What's it doing here alone? What, Traveler's did Journal. Expect it to have an entourage. Rejoice for the statues have granted my wish. The whimsical the statues? Their whimsical nature, however, must not be taken lightly, so before I soar through the sky like an eagle, I shall attempt a mere hop from the cliffs down at the beach. It shall be small feet for the man that can fly. If this experiment is successful, the sun shall be my next target. <laughs> um apparently he can't fly. Cookie time. Cookie time. Can you believe this? The man jumped off a cliff at the behest of some statues of all things. <laughs> you want some cookies? I think I for cookies. Um. Great deeds require a colossal lethal leap of faith. I myself have done the same. Might have been sick. Pure madness. How could someone be so utterly naive? Yes. Rivalon is no stranger to the supernatural. He might well have flown into the sunset and looked down at us cynics laughing. Well, he did now. Pragmatic and romantic. Okay. Well, I'm taking this. Thank you. Let's go not that way. This way. Never mind. Oh, cereal, by the way, dude. I don't know if you saw what I recently posted. There's a portal up there. In uh, the Discord, I found out how to do line of sight in Fog of War in Fantasy Grounds, my dude. So, like, if you guys are going through, like, hallways or something, it'll show what you can see. It's pretty freaking cool. I'm stinking excited. Aha! Oh, I misclicked out of the game. There's a backpack. Oh, see, I missed the thing. I wish I didn't accidentally get rid of that thing. Sweet. What's in the backpack? Open. Yo! <gasps> A helmet already? Minus charisma, lucky charm. Sight, hearing, movement, immunity to blind. Ooh. Whoa! What the fuck? What the fuck? Is this a joke? <laughs> it's showing the fucking... Oh my god. Fashioned by ingenious imp from far off realm, these utterly or unwieldy spectacles were designed for gazing into rifts. Use them on the regular world and you'll just be shrouded in darkness, but the exceedingly rare material they're made of palmerite just happens to have a powerful side effect. Luck. <laughs> well, I like the immunity to blind, but... That's funny. No, oh, put your pants on, man. Cotton candy dye. Why don't those stack? 
What is this bag? This is a weird bag. Painting of a landscape. Love grenade. Hell yeah. All right, is Scarlet not wearing her clothes? She's wearing her clothes. Okay. Wireframe. Yeah, that's the word I was looking for. Dude, look at her wands. Those look so cool. I'm right, making sure I'm not dropping frames. I'm just picking up all these shells be for reasons. Wait, no, pick that one up. I want it. I don't even need them. Effects unknown. Delicious. I ate it. Nothing happened. Oh, it gave me water resistance. Night. Whoa, listen to this music. Whoa, look at the super cool clam. Hold on. Wait, go back there. All right, well, they should be going there anyway. Ah, ah, ah. Those look like bads. Hold on. Can you get over here? How do you get over here? Uh. I might. So they would, they auto pass. All right, ignore them. No, fuck. Force hunters, how did they find us? Take the stone to the temple. All right. These whelps will be easy to crush. Smooth. It's smooth. Thanks As for letting me know, say, man. Okay. Hey, they gotta move first. That's not fair. Yo, get back here. Whoa. Are they Arise, running? Arise, fair dead. Seize upon our enemies. No. Ugh. What are you doing? Yo, that's not fair. Look at... Oh, I thought it was a fish person. Get back here. No, nah, you... Running bitch. Playing rounds. Look at I get to go first. Are you, what are you? Are you undead? <gasps> You're undead. Hmm. Zing, bitch. Yo. Oh, shit. I teleported over there. Whoops. I did not know it would do that. Zing. Wait, where's my, um... Where's my skill tree? Aha, I remember in buttons. How do I, um... Attack with my wands? 9 AP? Jeez. How do I attack my wands? Toggle sneak. Flee. Man at arms. It's in here somewhere. Oh, it must be in there. I got fireball? I thought I got the, the touchy move. Do I just attack like normal? Not enough AP. Shit. It requires 5 AP. Fuck. Uh, hopefully he can't get an attack of opportunity because I'm going over here. Haha, <laughs> fucker. Roderick's turn. Let's go. Let's get him. You want to go ugly? You want to go? Wham! Stand before me. Why are you immune? I just blew that dude up and he fell over. Let's go. Ow. Let's go. Hmm. I'm gonna... Zing, motherfucker. Ha ha. Wee. We did it. Now you can stay there. Yo. Any healed? That's awesome. You ready to go? You want a box? Let's go! Oh, we're the best. That's Their right. leader said something about escaping with a stone. Those things stolen from this dungeon, I imagine. Can we get inside? Hmm. Their leader gave 
Life to the dead. What? Oh, yeah. Also, this whole thing is freaking voice acted, I think. Like, number two. In order to say to report to our contact, it's nice not to waste precious time outside the cities. We can't well turn away from such odious sort of source. Yes, we're going to investigate. we briefed on our intended investigation, every wasted moment is an oh, outright shush, defiance Scarlet. of our orders. What did you guys drop? Gold? <gasps> Bracers? Please and thanks. Armor rating. All right, he has the same thing. What about you? Wait. Send to Scarlet. There you go. Damn it. You guys are garbage. And uh, the first one, you were able to mark stuff as trash. Or the second one, I'm going to get those confused. Access the optional tutorial by entering the dungeon behind you. Oh. This way. Okay. Oh, oh, rats, rats, talk. Has anyone ever told you you're as pretty as a star stone? I, I not fucking love it. Your ankles, but I'm sure of it. Best fucking talent in both these games, guys. You gotta get Pet Pal from the start. It opens up so much story. It opens up some of the best dialogue in the second one. Some of the best parts of the game were talking to animals. And you missed out if you didn't get it from the beginning. I love talking to the animals. I should have made her my um this seems to my be leader. Broken. This is mine. Uh well, I don't want to hit it. This seems to be broken. Thanks, Roderick. You the man. <gasps> Do I have any I don't have any key locks how do i run maybe that was a mod i think i had a mod that increased their uh run speed slightly because holy crap it takes forever to, to cross the map yep Ooh, i'll take that Okay, pushing circle auto loots. Cool. Move. Like that. Give me presents. That's a rat sound. Oh, that was a worm. Careful. There's a mine in the middle of our path. There is a mine in the middle of traps. Have an interest in protecting whatever's kept here. All right. I'm gonna loot these. Smoke grenade. All right. You attack this. Zing! Ow! Fuck. That still hurt me? Lame. Ooh! Another chest. I didn't open the other one, I just realized. Oh! Mouse! Mouse, 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 mouse! Come back! Must talk to you! Wait! Wait! There's another one. There's another one. Wait. Stop. Has anyone ever told you you're as pretty <gasps> as a star stone? I may not be able to see past your ankles, but I'm sure of it. I fucking love Pet Pal. It's the best fucking talent. <laughs> hey -ya. Hey -ya. You're like a gorilla in a porcelain store. I forgot about the... <laughs> I forgot about the narrator comes in sometimes. Hold on a minute. I picked up some new stuff. Robes. All right. Send a scarlet. <gasps> Tomb chest key. Yo. Is that the chest over here? What is this? Oh, a leader in sight. All right. Hold on. Yo, you're going to wear that. That's a, like, over double your armor. Wait a minute. Scarlet, what are you doing? Oh, but your other robe looks so much cooler. Wait, no. Oh, I attacked it. Fighting knife. Water balloon. Hell yeah. 
we're gonna go have us a water balloon fight well i got a tomb key or for a chest and i'm hoping it wasn't that one i just broke presents woo all right something give me lock picks or something oh maybe it was this i've always heard there's typically more to a king's tomb than meets the eye it could be a myth or it could be our lucky day i'm pretty sure it's a trap always is give me some lock picks lock picks no hello well no lock picks All right, tomb friend. Well, that wasn't helpful at all. Never mind. Bummer. A book. He who smelts it. <laughs> Wee. There's a little more than iron ore that turned into iron bar. Heat the ore and start molding it into the desired shape and size. Some say it's dwarves work and half the quality of good iron comes from the dwarvish know-how. But one can't always sit around waiting for a shipment of the stuff. <laughs> I learned how to make an iron bar. Sweet. Well, I'm gonna break this. Bonk. Oh my god. This is gonna take forever. Wait a minute. Can you fireball the bitch? Aha! Where there's smoke, there's fire. It did nothing. And now it's on fire. <laughs> I can't go over there. All right. Uh Someone give well, me a What's this? Ooh, I spotted. A button. A button. Push button. This seems to be broken. Wait, what's broken? I just clicked it. Works fine. Open. No, what? Freaking stupid ass door. Made short work of that door. But I don't imagine our weapons would survive such use. I know. I want that chest, but I'm gonna break it. Or I'm gonna break my weapon before the chest breaks. F5 to quick save. Ooh. A thing. A rain scroll. Why, thank you. I will take it. Oh, generous game, bestow upon me a rain scroll. Which I have to use immediately. Because there is fire. There's fire everywhere. Here, wait, water balloon. <laughs> okay. You're gonna cast a fireball onto this water barrel to put out the fire. That's meta gaming. Zing! Yo, it worked. Maybe? Whisperwood. Hiya! Put out the fire. I'm worried that. Oh! Rat! Rat, where'd you go? Hi, tell me your secrets. Has anyone ever told you? Oh, you said. One of your friends already said that. Well, I know I'm heckin' I pretty. Spotted. Oh, I found a. <gasps> I found a thing. Oh, it's that door for that. Never mind. Lockpicks, yo! Give. I am so glad I pushed Alt right there. That's mine. What was it? Fireball scroll. Oh yeah, we're using that. No, we're not. She's gonna use it. We're gonna zing a zing zing. Bam! Woohoo! 
All right, now we got to go back and open that stinking chest. Take forever to run over there. Ugh. How do I get regeneration in this game? I always forget. Suppose he could just heal himself. Zing. Good on you, mate. Tick. Don't break. Can they break? I don't remember. It wasn't even worth it. <laughs> Garbage. Oh, chest. That must be the chest we're looking for. Tutorial log, map, tactical camera. Ooh. Game menu, connection menu, log. Open. Careful. I've spotted a Yo. Trap just showed up. Better to detonate that mine safely than trip over it myself. I can't because I am not a rogue. Wait a minute. I have the key. Wait a minute. What? Under lock and key. Don't I? I could have swore. Tomb chest key. It's right there. It's locked. No. Wait. Lucky me. Cooking pot. Come on. Ooh. That was worthless. All right. Don't walk on the fire. Lock fix. Yes. Give. All right. Let's get out of here. Hello. Sure. Oh, monies. Monies. Oh, I do remember this part. I've spotted something. Yes, I did. Good on me. Ah, Scarlet. You come over here for a minute. You're going to get yourself killed on accident. Aha. Aha. I cover your disgusting. Oh, dude, he just chucked that. Hey, Gups, what's going on, my dude? Welcome to the stream with some cookies. Mama! Mama, come get cookies. Hey, thank you for cookie time. Thank you for cookie time. Does this one not have a. Aha, there it is. No, no, no. Oh. There you go. Aha! I thwarted your plan. A box. <gasps> Check it out, yo. Oh. It's the same exact... Damn it. Well, maybe the other one looks cooler. I don't know. Let's look. Put this one on. Hoping someone special will be impressed by the way you wield that great heaving weapon. It's the same. Weak sauce. So you a great heaving weapon. What was I doing? Who talking? I think I hear voices downstairs. Sneak mode. Oh, that's right. You <laughs> turn into rocks and shit. I forgot about that. You too. 
We're rocks. We're nothing but harmless rocks. Drag a candle and the oil to ignite oil. Hi. Oh, look, bad boys. Hold on a minute. Catch this. Ha <laughs> ha! I'm sneaky, boys. We're, we're just some uh, rocks walking around. Oh, he did. <laughs> we're just <laughs> fucking rocks. All right. Wait a minute. Buried mummy. Oh, they didn't drop anything. It's because I burned them to crisps. All right, let's <laughs> get out of that mode. Oh, this game is funny. That was a trap sound. We just walked over a trap. What the heck? Freaking me out. <gasps> Rat! Tell me secrets. Do you like shiny gems as much as those other fellows? I admit the kingstone was pretty, but hardly as a nice crumb of stale bread. Oh well, whatever tickles your whiskers. Love it. I love that they actually give them actual something a rat would care about. It's like, yeah, I don't care, it's shiny, but the fucking bread, mmm. Treasure plate. I'm gonna stand over here. Oh, was it that? <gasps> a chest. Oh, okay. I gotta move. This seems to be broken. Wait, I already did that. What am I talking about? What's over here? Secrets? Nope. No secrets. What about? Oh. Oh, I think that's the way out. Actually, uh, we're gonna do this. And this. Yeah, I'm a genius. I'm a genius. Don't care about your pots. Nothing. All right. Oh, mouse boy. Ooh. Take a hammer. Take some arrow shafts. Screw the cooking pot. Medium intelligence potion. Check this urn for dead people. There's a button. Ooh, a bone pile. Let's search it. Nope. Hey, Scarlet. Can you come stand over here real quick? Atta girl. Come, come rejoin the party. We're good. Yeah, I just did that game. Uh-oh. Saving. Ooh. Auto save. Oh, don't be a spider. There's webs. Oh, is that water? Yo! Ghost! A ghostman! Back up. He looks dangerous. A living rat dares disturb the my slumber face. of the dead. A thieving fool insults the sanctity of the grave. The bloodstone defiler, where is it? Who are you? Strange cult-like figures before the ancient June, they seem to have precious stone in the position. Strange indeed. Robed indeed. Your tricks will not save you from retribution. Deceiver. Rage Queen. The Bloodstone, deliver it now and I may deign to end you quickly. Who are you? In life, I toil to care for these holy grounds. In death, I protect them from profaners and poachers. The legacy of Cecile is mine to preserve. Her traitors are mine to destroy. Tell me about the Bloodstone. I suppose you only crept among these sacred tombs for leisure. I suppose you had no lust for the treasure of the dead. Ha! I'll take my leave. Run if you like, Defiler. 
Whichever way you take leads you to the grave. All right, dumb dumb. Oh, he summoned zombies. Wait, those are archers. I don't like it. My turn. No, oh, slightly out of range. That's going to stun my friend if I do that. All right, I can move two spaces. What if I do this? Fuck. Well, that didn't hurt him at all. Fuck. <laughs> Ow! Aha! You missed! Hiya! You did, sucker. To welcome you. No, don't shoot. Miss! Aha! Double miss. Chance to set blinded. Hmm. I have nine power points right now. Here, blind him. Haha! Eat that, stupid. I need to sneeze. <laughs> Blam! Oh, I'm behind you now, dum dum. Oh, I just wrecked their Death life. That was awesome. Fool. Death in a oh yeah, delay turn. I forgot about that. Dude, wait, he he not dead. Oh shit, he not dead. Now he's dead. <laughs> we did it. Didn't even get to go. Healing potion, gate key, two-handed practice sword. Yo. Hold on a minute. Oh, there's a hat. I don't remember picking that up. Plus one due to level difference. Hmm. Look at that damage, though. What's the level difference? I forget where that's at. Oh, level one, level two. Whatever. I'll equip it. Aha! Does it look any different? No. Here you go. Have a hat. He has a hat now. Ugh. Gross. It looks bad. I think there's a way to turn off hoods. I don't remember. Uh, something like. Aha. Helmet visual only in combat. Ooh, there you go. Look at it. I like her hair. I'm not going to make him wear a hat. <laughs> I got to put my helmet on in combat. Hey. Where are we now? Oh. Oh, okay. Go this way. found things. Oh, this is where the the people ran. A portal. Bird. Oh, I can't talk to bird. <gasps> A shovel. Yes, I remember I need that. Shovels. Yes. Waypoint shrine. Neat. Water balloon. Yes. Look at all these shells around. I don't even need them. I'm just picking them up. I don't even think they're worth like much money. Hey, the big shell. Look, look. Oh, it's Michelle. I forgot that he speaks. Upon which this poor shell must suffer. Yeah. Who are you, Sir Shell? Call me Ishmael, son of the sea, an outcast upon these wretched shores. An exiled shell doomed to live under a canopy of arid sky, not his native tender water. 
It seems strange that you talk. Of course I can talk. Don't be silly. There's more tongue to me than heart. That's true. Indeed, the surprise should be mine, for I still remember the days when your kind swung from branches and plucked the vermin out of their neighbor's fur. You don't see, uh, you say you're doomed? My fate is a cruel one, I assure you. How many hey, Crimson! You won't play Skyrim. Against their dirty little ears, only to claim they can hear the ocean. I've, uh... I keep thinking about playing Skyrim on the channel. Of course they could hear her, the brats. I don't know if I'll get bored though. The very edge of the great aquatic mother whose embrace I so Because I've tried to play it before long, long before I had the channel and I always got bored. I never made it very far. You don't remember the past very fondly. I'm an indulgent mistress to one who spends happy hours as she passes. But when your existence is one of misery. She becomes a lethargic hobby. Oh, I remember ancient times, for I have lain here since antiquity, when the ruins around us were palaces and the sun bleached dead merry children. All this I have seen, alive, alone, alas. Is the sea's embrace you long for? Yes, yes. I, King of Pearls, ache to repose anew on his coral throne. Taking people's treasures. Me the water. <laughs> Swing me as far as your arm strength gives lease. And treasure long sunk, I will grant thee. Oh, give me treasure? I what should decide to use you. kind knight? Will you return the King of Pearls to the sea so he may yield you long lost treasure? Sure. Kindness is its own reward, and there's the promise of treasure to boot. Let's throw him into the sea. Let's sell him to a local merchant. That's fucked up. <laughs> throw him to the Agreed. sea. Agreed. Let's send him home. Liberator, kind benefactor. Bless me the might of your sea bound <laughs> I just chucked him into the, the sea, ocean. The sea, I have returned. Where every wave feels like a mermaid's kiss. May the bounty of the deep be yours, along with my eternal gratitude. Mermaid's kiss. Hey, do you know if you, it's only cannibalism if you eat half a mermaid? Or a certain her, half a mermaid? That's dark. Mermaid's kiss. I got a ring. It gives 9 HP and water resistance. Sure, we'll wear it. Yeah, he just chucked that chest up here. Alright, let's go over this way. Look at all the shells around here. Jeez. More shells. Branch? I don't care about branches. I'm not picking those up. You've been had by one of them smooth talking ah! tails. Whoa, 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 Bad guys. I want to know what's over here first. Shit. Did I just walk in front of him? You see nothing. I want to get up here. See, look, there's stuff up here. How do I get up there? Wait, that's... Eh, I've already been in there. How do I... Can I Ooh, maybe I don't want to get up there. Look at all that bad. All right. Maybe I won't do that. Why is it making that noise? Usually it makes that noise when I find something. Hey, guys. Hold oh, they're right drunk. There, orc scum. No one slips past the legion. I'm challenged. They're fucking drug guards, yo. Calm down, Junius. Doesn't look, look like one of them walks to me. <laughs> Not a single old in sight, you know. Just hold your tongue with you, Bibius. Can't be too careful. We are sworn to protect Sarsfield. So you get shit-faced? We're sorcerers, hunters on business here on so, orders. you're sorcerers, are you? 
And how are we supposed to verify that? Yes, that, that is the plan, Crimson. We can't read. D&D &D like this weekend. So for all we know, those papers say you're a polymorph parrot on the lookout oh, for a speaking of D &D. bird cage. That don't prove a thing. I got in touch with a... A video... I don't know, what do you call him? A video artist? Something like that? Um, but... I've seen multiple streamers that have used him. He's, he's just like a really cool guy. I've seen him in streams personally. Um, and I've talked with him and he makes like intro scenes and all kinds of other stuff for a bunch of streamers. Um, he seems like a really cool guy uh, just from interacting with him. But I've always told him is like, if I come up with a, an idea, you'll be the first one to know. And I finally came up with an idea. I pitched him or I talked to him. I sent a message this morning and I was like, hey, man. I started a D and D campaign on stream and I have an intro sequence that I actually, I'm actually, I like it. It's cool. Um, but I told him, it was like, I've always wanted to throw some support your way. So, uh, here's an idea I have. I'm looking for like an intro sequence or something. And depending on price or whatever, uh, maybe a BRB or an, and an, and, or an outro sequence, um, kind of thing. Uh, let me know and if you need some of the resources that i currently have i'd be happy to oblige and he messaged me back and he's like oh heck yeah dude i would love to do that he's like i used to play 5e uh myself so uh he's like i think i got some really cool ideas i got a bug bite that's cool um and also apparently he was the guy that originally made that meme of the simpsons of uh i don't remember uh it's the fat kid and he's on a bus and uh he put the text above it that says, uh, when I roll a 19 and the DM says that's a miss. And then it has the kid in the bus and it says, I'm in danger. Uh, he made that meme, apparently. Uh, he has, he sent me the original tweet and was, that was awesome. So we may be getting some custom, uh, uh, scenes and stuff for our campaign, which I'm kind of looking forward to. Uh, also it depends on the price and stuff like that. I do want to send him support, uh, because he's a cool dude and you know, quarantine's going on and i like to support uh artists and stuff that i i've met on twitch uh if i can if i can afford it is the kind of thing but so look forward to that i'm kind of excited for it oh so i'm catching up on chat hold on your job's gonna have face masks good wait a minute are you talking Peter the people for the an uh so or the animal thing the animal people because if you are a PETA is a horrible organization i hate him our PETA is p-e-t-a okay yeah you're not talking about them okay i was gonna say yeah get out PETA's is awful because ingrid newkirk i think her name is the ceo of PETA, hates pit bulls and thinks they all should be exterminated Fuck her. And also, all the PETA shelters that you think you know, it's like, oh, they're for the ethical treatment of animals. Take them to a PETA shelter, they're gonna go find them home. No, it's like 80, it's a huge number. It's oh, it's higher than uh, the average uh, percentage of like rescues and humane societies that they put down the animals as soon as like people bring them in. Because they're, act they're, they're more interested in making money with their name because people just hear, oh, people for the ethical treatment of animals, they must be fighting for animals' rights. No. PETA is a horrible organization. I could rant for hours. Fuck them. Don't support PETA. You know what? We'll take you two to the wizard. I know he reads. He has books large as a house, that one. Yeah, he'll squeeze the truth out of PETA is a food place, one okay. Way or another. <laughs> yeah, they're awful charm intimidate and reason it's a cooperative dialogue it allows you to role play discussions between two main characters the wizard says then so going to me lead the way i don't need an escort especially not a drunken one back off or face me that we gave him the judge personality all right what do you guys think should we just say, hey, lead the way? Or should we say, hey, you drunken assholes? You're on guard. Yeah, I'm going to say you drunken assholes. Are you mad? You'd kill Legionnaires? No, I wouldn't kill him. Let's I just, just go to the beat him up. Peacefully. Yeah, 
Yeah, right? And, like, a lot of the stuff they do to help these animals is worse. It's like, that's horrible. Like, one thing, um... This one, I think their heart... The, the people that organized it, I think their idea was in the right place. They just were stupid. Is, uh, there was, like, a... I think it was in Seattle. Um, but there was a big mink fur uprising thing where they got all angry. And, um... They, like, broke into where they were housing a bunch of the mink. And they had the bright idea to just release them into the wilderness. Which, you're like, cool, you you rescued a bunch of animals. It's like, you can't just release hundreds of mink into the wilderness. And they decimated the, the fucking environment. Oh, my God. And, they, and they're super territorial, so they killed each other. It was uh, horrible. Horrible. Yeah, right? They look too drunk to leave me anyway. No, I'm not going to intimidate my character. She's cool. You let these loaded grunts order us around. I thought you had more pride than that. These two almost must take us for orcs and would have attacked us for no reason. We must rid the city from menaces such as thee. No, I don't want to do that. I'm going to just charm her. Stand down. Ah, oh, fuck. You want I forgot to about this. By and let them give you a good thrashing. Fuck. Stupid rock, paper, scissors. I win one. Oh god, she has more. I win two! She has a lot higher. Oh wait, no, we're both two. I win three! Oh my god, I won four in a row! I'm the best! Mm! I win. That one might be just scripted where you always win. No, no, we'll do as I say and there's an end to it. You defy the legion, will you? The punishment for that offense is death. Can we just knock him out? I didn't want to kill him. Fuck. Well. That's what we're doing. That's a touch attack. Zing, bitch. Hero, what's going on, my friend? Welcome to the stream. Ooh, wait, need to do this. Super power. And then we're just gonna go knock him over. Hiya! Boom. Wait, did I actually kill him? Because I feel bad. Wait, let's flee. I don't want to kill him. I don't want to kill him. Attack of opportunity. Ouch. He did. Fuck. Yeah, he did. Aha. Fuck. I didn't want to fight him. Are they going to fight me again? Yeah, he's hostile. Fuck. All right. Well, I did not want to kill them. Let it be known. That I didn't want to kill him. Stun failed. Fuck. Knew it. it. <laughs> that was the quietest one I've ever heard. Can't sleep. Yeah, you missed. You're drunk. You missed twice. Die, I feel bad. Now you can learn something useful. Like how to wash your under things. I gained a level. Press I or L. Uh, I feel bad. Are you gonna? Well, there we have it. Fuck. Two dead legionnaires. I'm sorry, Scarlet. No. I think you're right. We had no real reason to kill them, and yet we did. In cold blood. I feel awful. I want to reload. <laughs> I mean, I don't want to kill him. I just wanted to knock him out and take him back to the barracks. I didn't want to do that. I was just working. I'm sorry. I didn't want to do that. I'm sorry, dead guys. Ah, uh, and then I got compassionate plus one after fucking him up. That's off. I got a tooth. Hold on. Give me the... <laughs> I'm picking up a tooth. 
Okay, uh, I'm stealing their gold. It's cool. No, nothing bad here. I learned some a recipe. Oh, that's dirty hero playing the victory theme. Boop the snoots. Boop, boop. Got the double boops. <laughs> you got booped. You got booped, it, doggies. There you go. There's some doggies. Wow, I just learned a bunch of recipes. My gosh, look at all these recipes we just earned. It's still going. It's still going. Is it going to keep going? No. Wait. Okay. Um, that is not the button. It was I. All right. We got, we got new stuff. Ooh, speed is action points. Mmm. Mmm. Ooh, boy. Strength. Look at this. These are freaking D&D stats right here. Billy Shaper character can do and well perform. Yeah, we know. Uh... I can't do another man at arms. That's unfortunate. Let's do, um, I can't do, fuck. Really don't care about that. Nasty deeds, lock picking, pickpocketing, personality, charisma. Your the first impression you make on people and talent charming, intimidating, and reasoning. I like charisma. Actually, mm. fuck. Cookie time. I should give charisma to Scarlet because she has pet pal. Why am I slow? I heard cookie time. Hey, Siri, what's the cookie time? Mama's was just laying there, and all of a sudden she heard her favorite word. Want some cookies? And drink it. Whoa, I dropped it. <laughs> you thought you were getting to say thank you for cookies. <laughs> oh, that was um that was from Yeti Crimson. Uh he he's he had a a free gift sub to give away for uh his six month. And uh he decided to give it to you. Okay, I can't use Maybe I'll wear armor or get armor specialist. Man at arms, scoundrel, witchcraft, Ithrush, Arrowthrosh. I always pronounce that wrong. Should I give him lucky charm? I kind of want to give him more leadership because that makes sense. I don't want to give him a point. It feels like a waste. Maybe I'll just hold on to it. I think it, another one unlocks at level three, and then I can use them both. Oh, traits are assigned to your character and voicing opinions. If your character is consistent in their opinions, their trait points can result in a stat or ability bonus. Yo, I don't remember that. That's cool. All right, um, I'm not going to use his other point. We will give her. I kind of want to give her more speed. Although intelligence kind of sounds great. Because that would up my damage and stuff for my intelligence based spells. You know what? I'm going to give her a point of speed. Weapons. Defense. Mm. I kind of want to give her another willpower. I hate getting stunned and shit. That stuff sucks. Lucky charm. Oh, she got plus one lucky charm from romantic. That's adorable.
Maybe I'll give her charming. That's upper charisma. Yeah. There you go. Yeah, let's go. Why can't I? Oh, right. It's not right click. But guys, I'm very excited for Saturday. I picked that up. Nice. I cannot wait to have a, a session zero. Can I go in there? A hammer? Yo, there's orcs down there. There's a water barrel. Nope. Saving. Yo, a bow. And a short sword. All right, well, what's over here first? Holy crap, I'm hungry. Stomach just growled like crazy. Also, is that any significance to the little butterfly things? There's a weird cross hatching going on right there. Is there nothing hidden over here? Come on. What is those? Ooh, mushrooms. A mushroom mushroom. Okay. Onwards, mighty stallions. A tomato. Give me that tomate. Pull a Skyrim and just. Hump. Okay. Scarlet, you're up. Whoa, whoa, oh god. Okay. Hi guys. It's cool. Wait, that's a, that's a person. Please hold. Why can't I use my fireball? Uh, out of uses, excuse? Ah, uh, fuck me. I thought that was a skill I had. That wasn't, that was one of my wand skills balls. Okay. Um, fuck, they all go first. No, uh, balls. All right, delay my turn. No, ow. Oh, big boy going to smash someone. Oh, big boy going to smash someone. Oh, big boy smashing someone. Oh, big boy smashing. Uh oh, holy crap. On guard. On guard, dum dum. Guess what? No action points. All right. Huzzah! Hammer time. <laughs> How you like them apples? Fuck, you missed. Dink. Did nothing. You missed again. You suck, dude. Well, he killed one. Good job. They got three attacks. You guys suck. Oh my God. You guys suck. Yo, you guys suck. That guy, oh, he almost hit all three. Aha. He had four attacks. Well, that guy's doing all the work. You're lucky. I can't attack this stupid, stupid. Oh, slightly too far. I'ma zap you, zing, bitch. Wee. Oh, guess what? You getting the bad touch? Boom! You got the bad touch. Hopefully, you don't have attack for opportunity because I'm going over here. Ah, bye. Get him. Get him. Get him. No. Yeah, he wants to die. Get him. Poke him. Ha! Good job, guys. Well done, troops. Where are you going? Where do you think you're going? You ain't going nowhere. Oh, you're lucky. Ah, I thought you were dead. Fuck. Now you're dead. <laughs> Oops. I'm coming. I'm coming to get you. Oh, you're lucky. You're just out of range, you big derp. Oh, no, you're not. <laughs> Good job, Scarlet. You're the boss. Those orcs had a human commander. 
How very curious. Cloth shoes. Oh, the best. I, I killed him. Sorry. I really didn't want to. I didn't mean to. I thought I could knock him out. But it didn't let me. So I killed him. My bad. Take this. Take this. Oh, a tomate. Hail, Source Hunter. Why? I don't think I could ask for a more welcome sight on these cursed beaches. The Legion welcomes you. I was there. You won't know that. Tell me about uh, yourself. I'm not so different from any other soldier you'll meet around these parts. We've all lost more comrades here in Sicil than most do in an entire military career. That's fucked. Hey, you want... Crafting potions. Ooh. You only have 12 gold. So I'm gonna... Sell... Some garbage. Might need that. Painting of a landscape. The thing was worth a lot of money. Do you want some shells? Have some shells. <laughs> Here you go. You like this deal? Is it cool? There you go. Heck yeah. Oh, I should have Scarlet sell. Because she has better Beats charisma. Me what traitorous madness came over that dog? A man among orcs. It'd be like one of your kind running with a sorcerer. Whatever the cur's incentive to raise swords alongside that murderous lot, let's all hope it was a private grudge. Can you imagine if we had to add a slew of wild-eyed orc-loving bedlamites to our list of enemies in Sicile? Bloody orcs are at it again. Beats me what on earth they wanted Sicile. This is their second attack within as many weeks, and their second defeat. That rat-faced shaman of theirs even went to the trouble of launching a fireball at a ship in the harbor to the west of here. Fireball? It's hard to say. That ship needs attention and fast, or she's as good as sunk. Got any special source hunter tricks to make a blue sky turn to rain clouds? I kind of do. I'm pretty magic. I'm pretty magical. Oh. Oh. I forgot you can loot corpses. <clears throat> Did I forget to loot all the corpses in the, uh, that cave? May have. Oh, well. Ooh, a water bottle. A balloon. Dead friends must loot. One day, comrade. Taken before Vengeance his time. Will be Far ours. before his time. Can I go over here? Oh, I can. Oh, a chest. Give. Ooh, a crossbow. Male armor. Yo. Let's let's put this out. I got you. I got you. I got you. Hold up. Don't you worry. Will this actually work? I need to dry off. Yo, it worked! Hell yeah, I'm the best. Um Where's that armor I just picked up? There's a way to sort. Type. We got another backpack, huh? Okay, uh, boots. Gonna heck and wear those. What are you wearing? Wearing sevens. Seven thirty-six. Slightly less movement speed. But slightly more armor. Level one went lore master. Alright, I gotta read this. Learn things. Combine with Oh, that's not what I want. 
Here, Scarlet, you can have this. Alright. Good enough. Let's go. Who's grunting? Who's making the weird noises? Cat! Oh, I remember this part. Talk to Cat. What's all this ruckus? Sounded worse than a dozen tomcats fighting over the world's last map. It's Arhu! Ah, but I see we've suffered another orc landing. And judging by the relative ease with which it was dispatched, I can only come to one conclusion. Source hunters have arrived in Sysil. You're as welcome as a glass of cooled milk on a hot day, my friend. I'm Ahu, at your service. It was I who requested your presence in this troubled city. I'm switching. I'm gonna... I'm gonna make Scarlet the lead. Well, what does it matter? Daylight so you were, and so you cat? weren't. Behold! Behold! There we are. Meet my other half. What's up, dude? Look at this cool weapon. <laughs> no need to look so flabbergasted. I may be a wizard rife with tricks and guile, but I assure you, my plea is an earnest one. Oh, you know what I've been thinking about playing? Witcher 3. I've tried playing that game so many times, and I keep getting bored of it. Like, right at the beginning, too. I think I only have eight hours into it, and that's I've at least started playing it three times. And I think each time I made it to, like, the Griffin fight, which is apparently right as the tutorial starts to end. But I've been watching the show a lot lately, and I'm like, man, I really need to... It's like town one of the greatest games of all times, and I keep getting bored with it. But I get bored with a lot of those kinds of games, like Skyrim, same thing, Fallout. I, I don't do well with those games, but... I wanted to give I want to give it a good old, good old try again, I think. So, now that the cat is out of the bag, let us turn to the matter of Councillor Jake's murder. It's hard to put my finger on it. Just getting all this free experience to talk to him. This is great. Very whiskers that sorcery was at play. Visit the scene of the crime and I Oh, I just got a flashback in my brain the same. of how the second one ended. Man, there's some great clips from the second one, like the last fight. Oh, Captain, it was so cool! Freaking uh, the local commander of the legion. Why can't I think of her name? It keeps popping in my head, but I immediately escaping me. Blind to all but the undead. Uh, Losa. Oh, and her fucking, her fucking bard chant that she does. Oh, I'm getting goosebumps just thinking about it. That part was so epic. God damn, I love these games. Holy shit. Well, what does it matter? Assume there are suspects or something else I'd like to discuss. Where can I find the scene of the crime? murdered in a downstairs room of the King Crab Inn. King Crab Inn. proper. The Legion keeps it under lock and key, though, so you'll need Aureus' permission should you want to have a peek. All right, you gotta talk to Aureus, huh? Ow! Ow! Popped my toe! Ow! <laughs> that one hurt. Uh, he's been murdered. Assume there are suspects. So there are. Or rather... There is. Popular opinion has it his wife did the deed. But to be frank, I have my doubts. She seems a likely candidate, to be sure, but that would make her a sorceress. As Meralda knows That's a sorceress name. Yes, but I just don't see her magic extend beyond a frolicsome look and wink. Still, don't simply take my word for it, Hunter. It may be well worth your while to cross-examine her yourself. The Legion has her under guard in her shop near the town square. That's where you'll find poor Jake's widow. Um, it may interest you know that orcs were take, led by a human. A human, you say? Truly? But that would be like a kitten leading a wolf pack. True. And yet... I have heard rumors about a sect of sorts, a shadowy set of worshippers that associate even with orcs. Some say they're sorcerers, but people will say that about anyone who behaves a bit strangely nowadays. I don't quite know what to make of this news, but thank you for informing me. 
it'd be foolish to dismiss such a curious event out of hand. Uh, this isn't the first time you had a problem with orcs. Unfortunately, that is absolutely correct. The orc siege is yet another hairball stuck in this city's already choking throat, and it shows no signs of abating. We've cordoned off the western beach where most orc activity has been reported. For the nine lives of me, I can't seem to figure what they're doing here. There's nothing of interest along the waterfront, except for a set of caves with an unfavorable reputation. Maybe they're after some pirate's treasure, the fools. <laughs> Girlfriend here is like bringing a war what problem with the undead you're having? Ah, the undead. They've been clawing their way out of the ground for two years now. And for two years, the stalemate between them and the living has been dragging on at a weary pace indeed. The Legion did a good job keeping them at bay, but I think it's fair to say that without my magic-infused ballastay, they'd have gotten the better of us by now. Yeah, that's the problem with the undead. <laughs> Someone is responsible for the outbreak. Necromancers are at work, but who are they and where do they hide? Alas, that searching for them is like searching for a single louse in a lion's mane. Tell me about this cat trick of yours. Oh, but that's not a trick. It's a blessing. Or does it surprise you that I enjoy taking a feline guise? Such magic is a gift, Hunter. To tread upon the realm of instinct. Even articulate speech, perhaps humanity's greatest asset, cannot give expression to something so inextricably innate. To be out in the night, to stalk on silent paws and hunt with only the moon as your witness. You couldn't possibly imagine the thrill. But of course, it's handy to speak in more than meows. And I couldn't brew potions or make machines without opposable thumbs. This I freely admit. Let's just say I have found a way to enjoy the best of two worlds. Yeah. Whoa, look at all the stuff I can buy from him. He's rich as hell, too. Whoa. Yo. Yo. Ooh. Look at the damage. <gasps> summon wolf. Ooh. I want to summon wolf. <gasps> There's a purple ring. Strength and dexterity. Heck yeah, I need that. Ooh, a blue wand. Mm. Chance to set petrified status. Ooh, I want it. I said myself, if I don't start earning an extra gold piece in that, I'll walk out the door. Good on you. These boss men respect... Six HP allows you to cast summon wolf. All right, how much money does he want for that? Oh my god! Day labor's more suited to my nature in here. Yes. Honest pay for an honest day. Okay. Now! Damn it. Yeah, I hate this. This is the only thing that I hate. No! Oh, take my leave. I'm glad we've met Source Hunter. I need to talk to you. I'm, I'm picking up that we stuff. we have a lot more to talk about. Feel free to visit me whenever you want. I've set up a workshop in the Legion's headquarters. Yeah. Once you're there, just take the stairs. But do pay a visit to Aureus first. He may bark like a beagle with its tail stuck in the door, but you won't get very far in your investigation without speaking to the de facto leader of Sysil. And with that, I bid you No, don't adieu, leave. I gotta buy your stuff. Adieu and good luck. May your enemies prove to be mere mice and you the dauntless mouser. The writing in this game, so good. No, come back! Fuck! Looks like we have our work cut out. I wanted to buy your shit. Damn it, brah. Yes. Honest pay. Yo! A witchcraft spell. They're gonna buy your shit. That's a water barrel. Fuck, I don't want the water barrel. Put that back down. There you go. What's up, dudes? Oh, hail the rain spirit! 
That was a fine display of magicianship it was. Ah, who knew what he was doing bringing in a saw Santa, didn't they? How's the burning ship? Before the old gal's fate was sealed when the orc shaman set his fiery gaze on her sails. But you managed to rescue her from a watery grave. Closest thing to a miracle I've ever seen. I got you. Don't you worry. Where's Arhu? I don't know how you did that hocus pocus, but boy, am I grateful. Nothing worse than seeing a fine vessel like that disappear beneath the waves. What about it? I thought the old girl's fate was sealed when the orc shaman set his fiery gaze. You said the exact same thing as the other dude. Rude. Ooh, a fish rack. <gasps> Ooh, a chest. It's gonna be mine. I don't know how you did that. Hocus. Guys, saying the same things. Let me over here. No. Oh. The greatest warriors in Rivalon can't cross a road. <laughs> I need to wait, do I have a scroll of teleport? Balls. I need to talk to Arahu. I want those things he had. Those were awesome. That loopy legionnaire really thinks that orky charm loves him. What did he just get? Slow down, Arrowhead. I thought it was a golden apple. A home. A livelihood all sunk in a matter of minutes while we could do nothing but look on what happened these damn orcs they can't keep off this place for the life of them they came in here slinging fireballs and swinging swords wasn't a thing we could do to defend ourselves how about that burning that ship was a right stunning show of magic you pulled it was wish you'd have been around when our own barge went down in flames tell me about yourself well, we were merchants what seems like a moment ago. With our ships sunk, we're little more than three men with nothing more to say than boo. What about your with work? our ship gone, nothing for it but to get a job. Slim pickings around here, that's for sure. Maybe you can keep an eye out, though. Sure. You <gasps> log entry. Have you found us a job yet? We'll take anything. Really. Are you guys gonna say the same thing? Have you found us a job yet? Hey. I wouldn't source here in Sai Seal. Bah! Of all the cursed hunks of rock to land on, Conrad chooses this one. What do you think of that, that burning ship? Fast acting there. Many thanks on behalf of all us seamen. That was a crazy attack in the Who harbor. Who knows if it's even over for sure? Those damn orcs keep sending us these terrible surprises. <laughs> Ever hear about the time the captain took the Duchess of Feddle's carriage for the joyride? Ha! Now he did. He drove it straight to the pub and back. What do you guys got to say? Uh, and don't forget the tiny source here in Sai Seal. Bah! Yeah, he said the same thing. All right. All right, so we need a teleport spell. Wait, I might have one. I don't need to teleport a person over there. I need to teleport the chest over here that's all i need to do balls i don't have one all right i have to buy one oh, look at all the things to loot <gasps> a ball we gotta talk to him. I just got 90 armor or experience by oh wait. I could probably just walk in here. You what? Hey bull. Hey friend. I'm seeing a two feet. <laughs> I fucking love it! Approaching me and <gasps> Hey you are! My powers astound even me. Tell him about yourself. I'm Bull, the Bull. I love him. Leading clairvoyant in Sai Seal. The two feet never bother to ask, but I see all that is and is to be. Tell me my fortune. Of course, most winsome two feet. Of course. Uh, what would you like to know? Will I be wealthy? Why, yes. 
most wealthy indeed. But you must be vigilant, two feet, for I see that your wealth will come by bloody means. Will I be lucky in love? Well, that depends, two feet. That depends. I see that love has caused you to falter in the past. Yes, falter dearly. Potato. You must reconcile your mistakes before you will find true love. How will I die? Hmm. Death. Ever the most difficult topic to foretell. I see. I see. Oh. Oh dear. No. No. Your reading is over. I yeah. love Ball the Ball. See, but I've got the what about Bill? Well, tuck Bill the bull. and call me Bessie. A two feet address me directly. <laughs> I thought I'd never see the day. Don't know what you said to upset Bull, but don't worry about it too much. Being in tune with the flow of time takes a lot <laughs> out of him. Oh, me and my brother Bull have dragged this here cart all around Sicil, from dock to graveyard and back again. Good bulls, I love them. Ooh, waypoint. No. Where's Arhu? Ooh. I fucking love the ball. Wait a minute, fish pile. That's mine. I used to see orcs in every shadow when I had too much run. Now I see them sober. What do you got? Scroll of secret. Sure. I'll buy that. Steady, boys. Do you want uh, some robes? As soon as we're packed up. How about some... This one. Fuck. Wait a minute. You need to... There we go. Sure, even trade. Can I think, learn it and then immediately give it back? <laughs> and see, you heard the moo because the I switched to Roderick. And uh if you and he can't speak cow. Or whatever, you know. Or he doesn't have pet pal, so you just hear him mooing. Halt. These gates are to remain closed at all times. Captain's orders. Hmm, wait a second. Will I be a little red imp's uncle, the source hunter? Sorry for the gruff treatment. I didn't recognize you right away. Please tell me, how can I aid the investigation? Civilians aren't allowed outside? You can see security's tighter than ever around here since that surprise attack the Orcs put on a fortnight ago. They did enough damage to shake up Ahu and Captain Aurea something fierce. We can only hope to hold back the undead and these left field Orc attacks long enough for reinforcements to arrive. There it is. You got anything? No. I'll take my leave. Peace out. all these fishes these are mine we'll go give them to arhu make him happy an apple i don't even know why i'm looting all this stuff i never do the crafting Ooh. 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 Lucky charm. Fishing pole. Wait a minute. Oh, wait. Those are weapons. I forgot. I, th I was thinking that you could fish in the game, and I don't think you can. No zitchin'. You get a disturbing your beauty sleep, mommies. Ooh. Give. I just need to level up. Then I can spend my ability points on something. 
I need to sneeze. Crap. It's going away. <laughs> Woohoo! Excuse me. That was a weird sneals. Sneals, yes, sneals. That's what I meant to say. Um. Well, what's up here? Oh, a chest. Oh, that's right. How do I get over there? There's a little hidden area. All right, maybe I'll go talk to Arius first. I want to find Arhu. He had some good gear that I want. You should always make your strongest person carry all the gear and make them the charismatic. So you don't have to switch gear on selling stuff. It's annoying. Oh, go in there. God, duty's not so bad. Hey, what's up? Would be quite a bit better if I could do it in peace. Salutations! Source hunters, I see. I'm Sergeant Curtius, proud protector of this house of Legion goods. Tell me about yourself. Curtius is my name. The Legion is my calling. What's in that room? This is a storing house for Legion supplies. Perhaps the most important building in the realm by my and it's got a magic lock. And I, Sergeant Curtius, have been trusted to guard it. Got anything for sale? <gasps> Ooh. Look at that, that's awesome. Lucky charm and initiative. Ooh. Ooh! That's a normal chess piece though. And it's 158. You want some fish? <laughs> Wait a minute. No, I need to fuck. I need to pull these back. Alright, do that. That's good enough. Cool. Um Let's wear those. Report! Hmm. Alright. Nothing to report, sir. You never send a scarlet sort by type. Thing? Here. Drink that. Deals 5% minus one intelligence. Okay. Consume. 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 We got to learn all the things. Eat a bone. It gives armor? All right. Moira. God, duty's not so bad. Hey, what be quite a bit? Trophy of war. Do these are these actually useful or no? Just making conversation, mate. Mate, he says. We are colleagues, nothing more. Come now, it's just a turn of phrase. Okay. Will you now I will sell. Salutations. Source hunters, I see. Have I'm some Sergeant Curtius, proud protector of his stuff that I don't care about. This, 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 and this. You don't have nearly enough money. So what's bring that back? I have to bring some of these more expensive things back. Like that, and that, and that. How about that? There you go. Sell! Huzzah! He has, like, no money left. Later. Oh, I want to steal all your stuff. What's up? Keep your pleasantries to yourself. If it's conversation, that's for right, myself. Fine. You want to talk to me? Fine. Look at all the stuff we can steal. Oh, oh there's a mouse in there. I want to talk to the mouse. This place reeks of orc stench. You got something to say? Moira. Well, a source hunter. About time the council took us seriously. Maybe you can start with the two idiots hiding. 
And their pet orc here. Pet orc? You got something? Well, a source hunter. About time the cat took us seriously. Maybe you can start with the two idiots hiding their pet orc here. There you go. Thanks for your money. Peace out. Too bad indeed. Oh, Not even a <laughs> oh that's that fucking orc. I forgot about it. An orc in love. This is great. <laughs> ah, who better than a proven orc crusher? to convince my dumbbell of a friend here that orcs are predators, not pets. Enough of that. I know how dangerous an orc can be, but this one has been reformed. Anyone can see that she's completely docile. But my Look at that tail. friend here still wants to kill her. Tell me about yourself. Maybe before the great orc raid, we had time to indulge Ninius's idiotic obsession. Ninius. But now we're needed at our posts. I can hardly believe I've been wasting time protecting an orc when I should be running them through. Excuse my friend's violent outbursts. He hasn't enjoyed a woman's touch in quite some time. Zing. Now. It makes him a bit <laughs> edgy. Your woman's touch is less of a loving caress and more of a claw shanked brutally through the throat. I'll take my chances as a bachelor, thanks. What is this about a charmed orc? My friend here and I were patrolling outside the city walls when who did I see creeping along the shore but this lovely orcish lady. For a brief second, as, well, as long as eternity, we locked eyes. Perhaps confused by the butterflies in her stomach, she sprang up and began running, claws bared towards Marius. Fortunately for him, I had the presence of mind to ignore my sword and instead adroitly fling my pouch of trinkets towards her. A vial of love potion shattered over her head, oh. and when she turned to face me, she became instantly enamoured. That's that's how you stop war. Just love I'm potions sure for days. She must have been compelled to join the Orcish army under some kind of duress. A lady with such a sweetly savage manner She's would purring. never willingly join up with those vicious marauders. Ha! I can assure you there wasn't a hint of sweetness in those murderous eyes when she lunged at my throat. She may be confined here for now, but he who wants the orc booty. You not wrong. You not wrong. Rip to shreds. A love potion, tell me more. I've always had an amateur interest in all things alchemical. When I read in an esteemed periodical from the Wizards of Youthful Gore about an amazing opportunity that could change my life, I had to act fast or lose the once-in-a-lifetime deal. I sent away for the world-famous love potion, available for a limited time only, and it has worked exactly as promised. You see what a fool my friend has been. Spending all his cash on snake oil and bringing a temporarily tranquilized monster into our midst to boot. I don't think it's snake oil if it actually worked. What kind of monster would lie in a published advertisement? Advertisement? I'm sure the effects of the potion will be everlasting as printed. Let me tell you what I think. You see? He'd believe it was noon at midnight if he read it on a printed Can pamphlet. Please Did tell I miss? me you can I reason miss. with him. Or ditch reason and use your sword to shave him from his murderous darling. All right, Scarlet, let her live! If that potion was truly worthless, it wouldn't have been able to charm her in the first place. In this just state, she may prove a source of valuable information. You would yep. trust a quack magazine from Uthul Gore. She's clearly liable to snap at any minute. If you want to go after her, you'll have to face me first, and you don't take kindly to murderers. Don't you want to see whether or not this experiment proves successful? A real working lump potion? Think of the possibilities. Meh. Think of the intel this creature could provide. And if she begins to revert, these men are armed and will be able to subdue her. Uh, reason. If you were the only thing that stands between me and eliminating this threat, you won't stand long. Shit. No. Haha! -ha! Fuck. Fuck! Stop it! Stop winning! God, that was loud. I win! No! Stop it! No! No, 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 no! Ah! 
Fuck! I don't want to kill her! You're an asshole, Roderick! All right, we'll do it your way. Glad to hear I'm not the Fuck. only one with I don't want to kill her! Around here. I'll do the honors myself. No! She's harmless! Please! No! You bastard! You had no right! No right to Can I res her? Not only you from your own stupidity, Fuck! but myself and Roderick, the citizens you're an of asshole. as well. It's you we need protection from, Fuck. murderer. Fortunately, the wizards of Uthel Gore make a revenge elixir that will show you what's <clears> what. <throat> Go ahead and throw your sugar water on me if you like. Your foolishness is no longer my problem. Thank you, stranger. If you ever need help, I'll do my best to repay you. Nah, he crying. Fuck. Ugh. Well, there's two things we fight. We killed some guards at the beginning, and then we killed a harmless orc. Fuck. Why? Uh. Fuck. I'm upset. God damn it. Stupid Roderick. You jerk. Fuck. She could have had freaking intel, dude. Jerk face McGee. I don't like you now. You're a source hunter, aren't you? They say you can talk I to can't. animals, but I, for one, won't be falling for such a tall tale. I'll prove it to you. Source Hunter's here too. Well, if the Legion couldn't save this place, what are you going to do? You want to fight? Drink and gamble. That's all we do around here. Hope you fare better, Source Hunter. Thanks, Leia. Fuck! I'm still upset. Fucking Roderick, you asshole. God damn it, dude. What a dill hole. A mouse! I want in. Can I get in here? Hold on a minute. Hey, get over here. Take this. Wait a minute. I have lockpicks. Why can't I pick it? Uh. All right, fine. Let's go this way. Ooh. Whoa, freaking loud. What was so loud? Wow, look how pretty this grass is. This looks odd. See this? Like this bear patch? Ooh, Evelyn's house. Brooket and a broom. What's this? Everything's a sheep. I've spotted something interesting. Oh, a thing! I found a thing. The earth here seems to have been freshly fertilized and aerated. Obviously, someone has taken great care to maintain this gravesite. Are you sure you want to disturb it? I don't want to. <laughs> Why do you do that to me, game? No, I'm not gonna and disturb a it. Grace to whomever is maintaining this gravesite, too. You step away from the grave. Ah, Alright, sheep! I give milk. I love I you. Give wool. And what do I get in return? One way or another, they always try to fleece me. Especially that Evelyn. She's out to get me. I know it. Meh. Meh. Don't mind me, I'm just looting <laughs> all this stuff here. Cow! Moo! Don't disturb Master Theleron now. He's been so busy with his research, the poor dear hasn't had a proper night's sleep in months. Oh, what is that? Oh, a little dandelion thing floating. Thanks, cow. Oh, well. Another sheep. That sheep just did a jumping Bye. barrel roll. If you think black sheep are weird, try weir sheep. Weir sheep? Are those a thing? Uh, 
Ooh, a key. Reginald's spare key. Heck yeah. What's going on over here? Arhu, I need you to come out from wherever you're hiding. Oh, chicken. Rooster. Hey, talk to me. Liberty, equality, and brotherhood for all. We'll turn the wicked <laughs> cleaver of decapitation upon you. Revolution is coming. <laughs> okay, Rooster. Bye, buddy. Red and orange, yellow and green. The finest veggies, size seals ever see. Is that you? Sauce hunters, eh? All right, proper. We're finally getting a hand. Things is chaos. If you've got a favorite sheep, best to fry her up now before she gets thieved in the night like me dear plump hogget. The hogget. finest in me herd. What about your stolen yes. sheep? Oh, hogget's been missing for more than a fortnight. I love that sheep, you know. Was planning to cook her into a fine midwinter night agis myself. Oh, that's fucked up. Do tell I me love that sheep. I'm cook her. About her. I plan on pursuing whoever stole her with my cleaver in hand. Where's your herd? I recently sold most of the tender loves to a trader heading north. Plenty of business that way these days. Those miners must be preparing for a mighty great feast. Wish I could have a nibble on my dear darlings all ground and spiced. You creepy. Do you have any work for a trio of sailors? Sorry, can't help you there. I haven't got enough livestock left to warrant a hand with the work. All right, what about yourself? Now that the herd's gone, old Birch is just scratching by like a hen till the next batch of beasties comes through. What's this? Who smelts it? Sure, I'll trade you one gold. Peace out. Let's see. Burp. Halibut, sheep's cheese, tomatoes. Tomatoes? These damn birds won't fetch more than a pittance. Yay, learning things! What do you have, Cynthia oh, the Enchantress? Patron, I see your tarred eyes looking a bit teary. I've just the potion for that. Or would you prefer a toasty fire spell to dry those vapors? Yo, look at all the stuff she got. Debuff speed. I got arrow through. No, wait, I have water. Hmm. Wait. Stunned. Slow. Ooh. Quiet day on the market, it seems. Oh! Lockpicks give all. Uh. Look it. Aaron has as many friends as the man. 14 to 13. A hat. Red and orange, yellow and green. Oh, shut up. The finest veggies, size seals ever seen. Do I want that? A thousand? What's a thousand? Oh my god, the lockpicks are 380 gold. Alright, have this. And this, and this, and this. And this. Ah! I don't have enough money. I'm poor. Uh. Shit. Alright, I might have to save up for that later. 720! Alright, fuck that. There you go. Shut up! Who was ever saying that? I'm gonna murder you. The chicken. Don't talk to me. You're making me lose the focus. Can't you see I'm busy muddling? Obviously, someone's Hey, why are you a lucky person, my friend? All those naysayers in the past. See what I have become. He's <laughs> fucking rooster. From now, people will wonder who is that cook? It must have been a grand cook. So inspired. Alright. Tell me why you paint him. Hello, proportionate one. Oh, I can see from the symmetry in your face that you are a great fan of the fine arts, no? 
Tell me about yourself. I'm a painter by trade, as you can see, but a cartographer at heart. Do you make maps? You might think there isn't enough work for one of my talents in a downtrodden city like Sicil, and you'd be quite right. I travel around Andervale, mastering my craft and finding new subjects to add to my litany of lovely portraits and complex maps. Like this rooster I'm working on now, and the landscape that surrounds him. Elemental will inject some vim. Yo, what? Why are you jumping in front of a train and then a car and then jumping off roofs? You crazy man. I just stole a thing and no one cared. Alright. Oh, Jade is doing a bork. Hey, I'm coming in here. Who's having problems? But if one were to reduce the quantity of skull dust, Jade is doing a bork bork. Of, uh, two, hmm? I don't know if their camera's picking her up, but she's like doing little shakes when she borks. Oh, a sauce hunter. Can I have your staff? Imagine that. Quite a bit more petite than the last of your kind I encountered, aren't you? Yes, by nearly 20 centimeters of tibia, as my memory serves. All right, you're creepy. But, uh, no matter, no matter. Even if it couldn't spare its heartier specimen, I'm sure the order sent the individual with the next highest probability oh, of success. Oh, you're an ass. Yeah? Do you have any work for trio of sailors? Sorry, but uh, there isn't much work for sailors in a house of medicine. Unless one of them happens to have a secret stash of healing stones. <laughs> Tell me about Sysiel. Certainly. What would you like to know? Do anything about Jake's murder? The counselor. Terrible loss, that. Though we were hardly more than acquaintances, I knew him to be a devoted civil servant. Urbex. What's Urbex? Is that like, um... So, which of you is what's that called? Parkour? From what I can tell, it seems to be a simple case of jealousy turned violent. The affairs of his wife, Esmeralda, were hardly a secret, you know. Tell me about the plague. I've applied myself to that problem for two years and still haven't come a step closer to solving it. I declare it an act of the Almighty's, if I believed in such things. <laughs> the fucking rooster ran into his house. <laughs> control, more understood by mere I want to shut the doors. The rooster has to stay in here. Tell me about yourself. Me? Why? Uh, I'm uh, no, no, stay in more here. than a little surprised you haven't heard of me. Perhaps I can jog your memory. Fucking stuck up piece of shit. It was I who cured the Duchess of Arata of her unslakable thirst. A simple pinch of a tropa belladonna in her morning tea. <laughs> I who discovered that aging itself can be halted by a single application of secuta du glacie on the tongue. Not to mention that it's been my guidance that has permitted my apprentice Evelyn to make quite a name for herself around See, Sicilia. this is writing. Come, like, make your case. if you guys have been paying attention to how people speak in this, the people with certain, I don't know what you call it, professions or statuses, so, which of you speak in very certain ways. Life? Like, the soldiers speak case. pretty plainly, but this guy as a mage or doctor type or magic user speaks in like very eloquent ways that's good writing Anybody? i want to do that in the dd campaign but i'm not good with words especially when dropped on the spot your apprentice has enjoyed some success let's yeah yes yes <clears throat> If that's how we're referring to the secretive use of a revolutionary healing method, she refuses to share with her own oh, master. Oh, exploring abandoned places. Cool. She's in the other room as we speak. Perhaps you can prevail upon her to offer a demonstration. Revolution hearing method. She's gotten a hold of a stone, supposedly capable of fantastic... She's got a philosopher's stone. But she won't let me take the briefest look at it. But she claims to have gotten the relic from a little northern town, uh, Silver Glen by name, and that an abbot there blessed it with the power to heal. Utter rubbish, I say. Is she but making the undead? Blasted, undead, haunting the travel routes. I can hardly march up to Silver Glen to learn the truth myself. All right, tell me about well, her. Well, she certainly possesses a critical eye and an exacting Did manner the when it escape? comes to making difficult medical decisions. I expect she'll be a very successful healer in her own right when the time comes. She is learning from the best, after all. You fucking stuck up piece of shit. 
Oh, I should buy those. Judene. That's a drug in the second one. Good enough. Peace. A mysterious healing stone. Interesting indeed. Nothing sets me on edge so, like inexplicable oh, magic. Deserving of life. Come, make your case. This lady. Oh, that's Evelyn. She's fucking scary, dude. Did you just hear what she just said? Oh, that's locked. Excuse me. This is a private sick room. Who in the name of the seven do you think you are barging in here? Out, I say. Right this instant. Tell me about yourself. Oh, I'm sorry. It's this task. I'm just... Who am I to meddle with life and death this way? You just change your tone right away. I'm an apprentice of the healing arts. Healing. But this decision feels like precisely the opposite. I have but one healing stone, you see. And two direly wounded men who need it. I've been racking my brain trying to decide on the best method to settle this Oh, no. Situation. Don't make me choose. better off in the hands of an esteemed source hunter. Surely oh, you are more accustomed for. to What does good vibes do? Oh, it just sends good vibes. Just nothing really. This trouble of mind. Kind of got uh, I kind of want to buy all these. About your healing yes, stone. Yes, a curious relic indeed. I got it from a kindly abbot, Loik by name, in the northern town of Silver Glen. He is of a certain faith, the Immaculates, they call themselves, that espouses the belief that certain stones can heal wounded flesh. I myself was nothing if not skeptical of his claims, but something happened. I almost to need treaties. Stone. See with the five bits. How come I didn't hear an alert? Leaving no trace of the wound. Needless to say, I saw the I flashing lights. They took a photo of That one's mama's. Take a photo of babies. I don't know why oh. the alert didn't go off, but I heard the sounds. Or I, the lights flashed. That's annoying. But it's strange. The stone Thanks for the bits, my dude. I appreciate it. Use at a time before it reverts Get to a butt. useless, inert state. It takes time to regain its magical properties, and I guard it cautiously. All right, tell me about the patients. What would you like to know? Tell me about Boris. One of the brave hey, it's Boris. few willing to traverse the trade routes plagued by the undead. A young man, but excellent in matters of business, before he fell victim to an orcish club in the north, that is. Thankfully for him, a cattle trader found him, nearly dead, but not quite so, and brought him here straight away. All right, tell me about Stephen. Quite the venerable staple of Sicil, Stephen, and recently blessed with his third grandchild. He was leading a crew of builders when a stray beam struck him in the temple, and only a few days shy oh. of his last day of work before retirement, That's rough. no less. Nearly everyone in Sicil is familiar with grinning Stephen, and as you can imagine, he's quite dear to his family. I think we have to go with Boris because at least he has a life in front of him. You are? Ah, oh, I thank you a million times for your help. Who have you decided should receive the healing? I don't want to make this choice. Let me out. <laughs> Fuck. Uh... He... <laughs> Boris's life has just begun. Yes. Fuck. Boris deserves to experience all the pleasures of life that Stephen has already enjoyed. Boris it is? Yes, I'll deliver the stone. I'm glad we'll get to save one man. My heart Damn it, man, this is rough. For the other. Can I sneak in here? Uh, no, no, this is highly oh, abnormal. Yo! What is this? Yo! Lightning. I'm to ruin this particular batch. Ah! Yo! Um. Oh shit! Is this a dream? I forgot about this. I don't think so. Fuck. That stone. Somehow it sent us flying into the stars. God damn it! Oh, I should have listened to my instincts. Everything was telling me not to go into that house because it progresses shit. Look terrible, at the lights lighting them. Terrible, terrible. Hey, Zizax. 
words, what's this? Two Rivalonians here at the end of space and time? How very, very, very curious. Who are you? And how did you get here? Actually, we were suddenly mysteriously transported here. Do you know how or what? Your guess is as good as mine, my newfound comrade. Here I stood upon this tiny vestige of space and time, and there you appeared. Quite good timing, by the by, because the ground here has been fast shrinking beneath my feet. Oh, um, but uh, I suppose I should make a proper introduction. Zigzags the historian at your service. It is my job What's to up, Yuri? Thanks for popping in, my dude. How you doing? Cookie time. What are you doing here? What are you doing here? Cookie time. Attempting to you guys need to fill up your cookie bar. Say that guy's almost for cookies. All that is from yum yum. Hey, what happened to your nose? Cookie time. Why do you have blood on your nose? What'd you do? Did you guys bite each other? Sarah. I say, thank you so much for cookies. Um, why do you have no blood on your nose? What'd you do? What'd you do? What'd you do? What'd you do? I don't like it. Neville, another level of infamy. In payday too. <gasps> and pop up my pets. Oh, oh. Did you guys just see Jada jump? Hi. Get them all. Get that butt. Oh, butt, 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 butt. Oh. Get that butt! Oh, get that! Get that booty! Get that booty! Hi, doggy! Hi, doggy! Get that butt! Get that butt! Get that butt! Get that butt! Oh, they think a butt of that. Who got? Got dead skins again. They need baths again. They both rolled in the dirt earlier today. Turd birds getting all the dirt. Get them! Oh, the butt wiggles! Did you guys catch that? She did the butt wiggle. And she's like, oh, that was, that was some good itchums. That was some good itchums to do the butt wiggles. <laughs> Where are you going? Pushing me away from the computer. He's like, no, no, I'm not done yet. I'm not done yet. Are you? She's under the... Ow! He went under the desk. Ow, you're stepping on me. Go, doggy. Okay, you're going to lay down. Tell me, Go lay down. When I go lay down. that this place is the end of time, <laughs> did your heart... Chicken, Love and butt wiggles. <laughs> rock. If not, they should have. Time ought to have no end at all. Indeed, I can think of no worse nightmare for a chronicler such as myself. But something totally, utterly terrible has happened. What exactly has happened here? Show, don't tell. I always say so. Go, peer through yonder looking lens and feast your soon to be terrified eyes on the darkness that is a prison. Darkness! That it might be quite, quite mad. Then we'd better appease him and have a look through the looking lens. Bottle of beer! Oh, these are mine. You don't need these. I'll leave you with your pillows and your plate, though. <laughs> All right, let's look through the lens. Oh, he had a desk. Who? A dragome. Nefarian's here. You looked. You saw. Terrifying, isn't? What's this? The portal. It's... it's... What the... The portal has become active! Fantastic! Astounding! Onward we should go! You gotta learn what all these do by eating it. Can I eat this? Yes. Oh yeah, it gives random effects. That's right.
Okay, I think I've eaten everything. The portal is here! The portal! It's quite sprung to life, just like the long dormant flames that decorate this observatory. After all my waiting and hoping, could it be? You, dear stranger, you must be the key. Are you the gatekeeper? Your presence here is causing the end of time to Actually, no. grow. Keykeeper. The true end itself to move further away. Those torches, a light. This portal active once more. It cannot be coincidence. This fire is floating here. Uh, can we first discuss what we witnessed? Goodness me, how right you are. There's so much to take in, I'd nearly forgotten. And what you saw has been haunting my mind since I first discovered it. It is the void itself. The dragon that is devouring creation. When I speak of the end of time, this is exactly what I mean. I can't say for sure where it came from, how or why, but I do know this. It's shrinking our future by the second. And if we don't stop it, it will devour the past and present as well. You believe we're connected? It's not that I believe, it's that I have seen. Long have I been waiting here, hoping that one day this very portal would ignite. Then, no longer than a few mere moments after you arrive, Zap it goes. The chronicler of time knows a pattern when he sees one. What's beyond this ah, portal? Though I cannot say for certain, if it is what I believe, then our prayers might well be answered. In fact, every last question that ever plagues your noggin might well be answered, for I believe what lies beyond this portal is nothing other than... But why spoil the mystery? As soon as we leap through, we'll find out for certain. All right, after let's go. You, after you. Oh, what you could totally be tricking us. Find on the other side. Let's go. Yes. Can't go anywhere else. Oops. Like hoped. There she is. There it is. Come, come. All right, you go over there. It seems the imp has spotted exactly who and what he'd hoped to find here. Oh. I'm having a vague recollection of this. Butterflies! To the first garden. Can I actually go there? No. Oh, butterflies. Can you run faster? What's this way? We'll come in a minute, goblin friend. Got some lightning thing going over there. Just more portals. Yeah. All right. All right. I'm coming, don't worry. Whoa, look at that one. That one's cool. There's so many portals here? Oh, are they all just elements? Is this gonna be... Hold on a minute. Fire. Air. Mm, ice. I guess water. Oh, right there. Fire, earth, air, water. Okay. Neat. Oh, stealing this. <gasps> a chest. No, no, no. I am the last chest. The last chest. The last chest. If you believe yourself worthy of rifling through my ample treasures, I do dare you to prove it. Find my four sisters. No more than one in each of the realms of your wide world. And each by each, you'll discover how to open me. Ah. Okay. Oof. Hey, there's a person. Could it be, milady? Weaver of time. The weaver of time, mother of history, author of all that has ever been. 
Fucking little ass bugs, man. And you smash them and they're like so small that even crushing them, they're like, nah, I'm fine. You have to like roll them. Indeed, Sir M. Whoa, look at her eyes. As surely as you are he who chronicles all that I weave. Astounding. Unbelievable. I have so many questions for you. So much to ask. So much to say. You have brought guests, I see. Strange. Very strange guests. My reaction exactly, milady. It was their arrival here at the end of time that instigated my finding you. But why? Surely you must know. This is a question better put to our guests themselves. Tell us, how did you arrive upon this plane? Hmm. That's pretty cheeky, but I'm going to say it was a stone as Zap is here. Stone. So, it was a stone that caused the great shock of energy that brought you here, and it infused you with new life as well. Is that so? New life? Have you Not seen it before? Like this, no. What happened to you is unique in all my work. Never had I experienced something so... Mama! Contrary to my Did you nature, just throw up? To Why are you looking the ground? I had not it seen, stinks. had not expected. Life does not simply spring into existence, you see. What are you doing? You know? But yours has. You appeared before me. Right, I need to go check. You came into <laughs> contact with that what stone. the heck is going Star on over here? I now know it to be called. Hey, look at it. Hey, I'm just being weird. Next, Madam Weaver, how is it? Possible? Madam Weaver, that's cool. Do you not Name. see all? Have you not woven all that is and could ever be into your tapestry? Like the stones, your guests are a mystery to me. I see them before me in this world, but their likenesses appeared not upon my tapestry until they revived the stone. Source hunters, it would seem that yourselves and Starstone are inextricably linked. Starstone. Why and how, I cannot say. But I do believe that finding more stones will reveal to me who you yourselves truly are. Where does it come from? Starstone is not what it seems, Source Hunter. Its true nature must be part of a greater secret. A secret lost, even to me. Do you see what violence my work has suffered? What wounds lay upon the tapestry of time? Mysteries of all time. Gaps in history. Oh, how they've tormented me for eons. It would appear that Starstone transforms at your touch, granting me new thread by which to mend the tapestry. Thus, it restores time itself. I see what the void would shrink, Starstone restores. Yes, though I cannot explain why this Starstone is the antidote to the void's ravishment of our realm. If we do not restore time, if we do not discover the true nature of these stones, the void will consume us all. Hmm. The stones can heal history. You must seek them out, or we are source hunters of Rivalon. We have a mission that doesn't involve chasing down magical stones. You know what? We gotta do the history one because that's bigger in the greater scheme of things. Indeed, you must. Though I may not yet understand why, it seems that you and you alone level can unknown. unlock the powers within Starstone. Yet we are not the only entities who know these stones to be so much more than pretty gems. Why, of course, 
that's what they were doing. I have recorded their doings, you see. Collectors of Starstone, more and more by the day. Now I understand. They'd keep the stones from our reach. They'd prevent the mending of time. Without these stones, Hunter, there will be no Rivalon. The entire tapestry will crumble. Even this plane will fall victim to the Void's insatiable hunger. Hold on a minute. I just realized something is goofy. Alright. Should be okay. Uh... That shall never be. Lady, as sure as Zix comes before Zax, we will put a stop to it. First, we mend the tapestry, then we stop the void. Please, our most mysterious guest, are you ready? Are you willing? Will you hunt out the stones? Will you help us restore what has been lost? Not a sort of moment ago, we were hunting source in Rivalon, and now we're being told that we alone can prevent the end of time by way of some magical stones. What do you make of it? Do tell. Yeah, I can't deny a reaction to the stone. There must be something all as mad as it may seem. No matter how improbable, anything is possible. If the Weaver tells the truth, we have some serious work ahead of us. Yo. Did it. All right. Tell me. Let me check out your books. What it be, Nothing. Do tell. I'm trying to look at books. Books. <gasps> Ooh. Bl oh, I'm blank skill book. You if you're up to the Light gold. Oh, heck yeah. These are worth money. All right. What do you got? The glint in your gaze and the set of your brow suggest to me that you've not given up on our dear old Rivalon, not just yet. No, with you searching out Starstone, I believe we'll mend the tapestry in no time. We'll find out just who you are and how exactly to send the Void back to wherever it came from. But you'll need a way to travel between Rivalon and this homestead, won't you? Mm -hmm. Who wouldn't want to see Or oh, are these the triangle or the pyramids? Your or is that only number two? And who knows what the weaver might discover about you? Luckily, the power of portals is known to you, so I'll let you in on the little secret of how to transport back and forth from the end of time. I just, you know, don't go sharing it around. Never know who we can trust these days. Off you go then. You've Starstone to find, and I've a tapestry to examine. Surely there must be some clue here as to how on earth you're related to the end of time. Reaver times that her finding Starstone helps her weave the tapestry once more. How is that possible? Must my heart hope to fade in the void? I honestly don't know. But ask her. If she claims it is so, perhaps she knows why. And more questions for you. Imp said to the ballista operator, shoot. Where should we start looking? It just would that I had a starstone sightseeing guide, but alas, such a booklet does not exist. Just like yourselves, starstones are curiously absent from history, both in my writings and on the Tapestry of Time. From what I can gather, though, they were once cherished by devious sorcerers whose reign ended long ago. The stones are therefore most likely to be found in the ancient places of this world. Okie dokie. Ruins. Caves. The lairs of long-forgotten evils. Those are the dens you should frequent. Two more pieces of advice. Don't go unarmed and consult with my agent. Who's your agent? You say the imp historian, how? but you seem to be more than a mere imp and more than a mere historian. Oh, I don't know if I'm more than those things per se, but having been given a divine mission does have its perks. 
Old age can't touch me, that's one. Immortality is mine, as long as no one skewers me with a sword. And even then, I'll be back in a jiffy. But of course, I have a price to pay for something that is priceless. It is my duty to record all of history, and an arduous task that yeah, is. Yeah, that sounds insane. Not to mention how much stress that void out there is causing me. The end of time. I'll be out of a job. That's what your worry is? <laughs> out of a job? So, gather those star stones so that we may know the history that was lost. No, so that we must not repeat what leads us to this dangerous precipice, but do better and close the dark eye of the void forever. Aren't you lonely? Lonesome, observing the frontier of creation, surfing the vibrant tide of the eons, always approaching yet never reaching shore. Lonesome being privy to all that has been and all that is. Well, yes, actually. I don't mean to complain, but one certainly doesn't mind a bit of company now and then. Yeah, can you imagine just centuries going by before you even saw another face Perhaps in person? you can imagine the profound pleasure it is to have made the weaver's acquaintance after all these years. I can hardly wait to pick her brain about the great battle of the sons of Sigurd. The last Rivalonian who remembers it died more than 7,000 years ago. How are the stone or star stone and the void dragon related? Neither do I, but the mere fact that activated star stone has set the weaver of time weaving again more than implies that it and the void dragon are natural enemies. This in turn more than implies that you are the Void's natural enemy, for it is you who is setting new events in motion. You who is handing the Weaver new threads. And that which she is weaving is more than an ornament to decorate the shelter plane. It is both history and future history. It is all of time. We may not understand the how yet, but our aim is clear. We shall save creation from the grip of the void. Now, isn't that a lovely mission? Before you go, Source Hunter, a final word. Once you return to Rivalon, there will be someone waiting for you. Oh, your agent. My agent, my eyes and ears upon your world. I hope he'll be able to help you as much as he can. Time, I need hardly remind you, is of the essence. Can I actually talk I'll to her? Aha! Uh -huh. Ooh, this she got stuff to trade. Our most honored guest. I hope you begin to find this place more familiar than it may yet seem. Use the rift travel button to any waypoint shrine you've discovered. Oh, well, it's pointing to something that uh, we can't see because I opened this. Please tell me about yourself. In the ethereal threads of eternity. Do I record the deeds of gods and men, of beasts and spectral apparitions, the drift of continents through changing seas, the rise and fall of empires, the shift of every grain of sand on every beach, Whoa. the fall of every raindrop on every Yo. world, the all but imperceptible touch of lovers' hands, this and all I chronicle. Without Holy fate. crap. Except, it seems, you. I have more ask, questions. And I shall answer. Who are you if really? I, can. I am the weaver of time, as I have told you. Though my existence is one that falls behind and yet far exceeds the verb to be. Dude, this writing is so good. I am but what I am, and that is task. It is the same for the historian. Chroniclers both are we of the epics of eternity. Perhaps we are one and the same. Task multiplied by two. Who has made us? I do not know. Why have they done so? I do not know. Am I the beginning? And am I to be the end? Who shall say? 
Perhaps I am the first thing in creation. Perhaps I am creation. Perhaps I am the creator. Or maybe it is you. You who makes dying stars rekindle. Time alone will tell. Why is the star stone so important? Why does it react to me and my colleague alone? Alas, the answers to those questions still elude me. You and Starstone remain the imperfections upon the tapestry. As yet. A hidden answer lies behind this veil of inscrutability, though. For the link between you and the stars... That goblin guy got huge. That your destiny he was tiny, but he's massive compared to her. I believe that star stones will not lead you to new places of wonder only. No. They will also lead to new knowledge through the restoration of the threads of old. Alright, I want to know if she's lonely. <laughs> oh, Hunter. I have no need for company. Like I have no need for air or appetite or affection. That sounds sad. All I need and all I am is time. And time is running out unless you remedy its decline. And yet... I do enjoy your companionship, for you may prove to become the cure that will heal my slipping soul. That's not Amelia Tyler, is it? That's not the same voice, voice actress that did a Malady. Is it? I have to look that up. I don't think it is. If I understand correctly, I'm not at all featured on the canvas of time. Quite so. Your absence. It should be an impossibility, but no matter where I look, you cannot be found. I do not know you, which makes you my one perennial imperfection. A blind spot in the eye of time. But perchance I may be cured of this blindness. Perchance the blemish may be undone, and time can be redeemed. I've heard this place called the end of time. Is that what it is? No more, no less? How can I redeem time? Is it as you say, I'm not part of it. I think that perhaps you can redeem time because you create time. Indeed, you have set in motion an event I no longer held possible. Know that no longer I did weave. I sat here at the end of time and watched on as the void frays the fabric of time like a terrified god that fears the offspring of his own creations. Jesus. But suddenly there was you. You who stirred the life within the stones. These stones, children of stars, they place new ribbons along my fingers like phantoms out of time. New threads emerged, and I began to weave anew. Starstone gives me new strands to braid into the tapestry. And because you give Starstone energy, it seems that you are creating time these star stones please seek them so that time may yet be mended please for the sake of all that lives and all that loves seek them so that the void may yet devour itself alone Oof. for this place called the end of time what it is is but a seed bereft of sun and water what it could be that is what the star stones will tell us what it is is but the end. What it could be is the end of ends. I reside in another realm altogether. But ever since the end of time appeared in these deep dark skies, I materialized here as if forced to watch the one thing that is unwatchable, unendurable. A thankless task that you may yet free me from forever. She's got purple dust. Do you Good have anything? To see nope. You on the shed. All right. This thing. Aha. Uh. Do you know more about the void? What it is? What? North Gate, I think. I think that's where I want to go. Man, that was a lot of freaking history and lore. Oh, it's Arhu. Oh, I'm gonna buy your shit. Source hunters. I welcome you once again to the realm of Rivalon after oh, you know I traveled, the chasms huh? of space. Nice to have found a shelter, wouldn't you agree? Where you can come to no harm. 
I know the imp historian has told you about his agent on Rivalon, and that oh, okay. agent is I. So now that you know of the alliance between me and Sir Zigzax, let us turn to the business at hand. Starstone. Uh. Our business at hand is the murder of Chancellor Jake. So it is, and so it should continue to be. For I suspect his foul murder and the plight of dying time are somehow interconnected. Dark webs are being Does he have a cat plushie parts, and it is my on his belt? Belief, star stones are the flies the sorcerer spiders are trying to catch. It can therefore hardly be a coincidence that Councillor Jake was a collector I of have the to stones zoom into him. we seek. That means the task you have been given remains crucial. Find the assassin that did away with Jake, for you're bound to stumble upon Starstone along the way. How did you find out Jake was... Yeah, I just... Sell me your stuff. No! Damn it, it's gone. That's upsetting. That's super upsetting, man. Dang it. Didn't I get another gold thing? It was like a gold spoon. Did I not pick it up? Gah. Oh, it's... Ah, fuck. There it is. You okay, lady? Can I consume that? Nope. Not yet. All right, give me. Oh, we're good. Oh, I'm heckin' poor. How do you find out? Oh, man, that's upsetting. He had some good items. How did you find out Jake was a Starstone collector? While you were being lectured by our friend, the historian and the Grand Dame of Time, I snuck into his house and had to look around. That's convenient. The advantage of being a cat, you know. You go where you please with impunity. And sometimes the lady of the house even rewards with a slice of fresh herring. That's where I saw them in a cabinet. Mere slivers, but specks of star stones nonetheless. They lay there, silent and innocent. Though bloody murder may have been committed in their name. How did you become Zizax's agent? I met him first, a long time ago, out in the wastes of Uthal Gore. He wondered aloud what on earth a cat was doing out there in the scorching desert, then shared what little food and water he had with him. So I told him who I was and showed him my human form. He laughed and marveled and told me stories about his travels. In the end, he even shared his great sorrow with me. The unspeakable thing you saw through his looking lens. I was awed and frightened, but swore to help him in any way I could. As of now, that includes helping the two of you. Do you put absolute credence in the words of Zigzag's time void the looming end? Let me phrase it like Zigzag's might. A universe without time is like a pen without ink. A pointless instrument stripped of the potential of creation. It is void. It is death. It is... nothing. I'll not pretend to have all the answers, all that I understand, all that is happening here and out there among the stars, but I do know I'd rather err on the side of caution. If Zigzag's worries, I worry. We are talking about a creature, after all, that has reclined among the divines as nonchalantly as you and I lays beside the hearths of home. Why is it so particularly nice for us to have found shelter somewhere? Don't we all long for a sanctuary where our worldly troubles can be held at bay? A bed or a basket so snug it becomes, in a word, safety. But perhaps I speak only for myself. Not for veterans such as yourselves that 
by necessity call any patch of ground they rest upon home. Like any cat worth its salt, though, I deeply cherish a secret refuge unbeknownst to anyone. To be able to repose without a care is okay? such a precious circumstance. Save it all too seldomly. Oh, before you go, here, take this teleporter pyramid. Aha, there's the pyramid. A handy toy indeed that Zigzags asked me to give to you. You'll need the other one too if you want to make use of its powers, but alas, I seem to have misplaced it. Don't worry though. Use this one here and it'll take you straight to its twin. Now that this matter has been settled, hunters, I shall detain you no longer. But rest assured, I'll do my share of hunting too. So if you spot a white cat during your travels, do stop to say hello. Don't disappear. I want to look at your thing. No. All right. Teleporter pyramid. I'm in the middle of something I have not figured out yet. Okay. I think it's F8 was the real safe. I'm three hours in. All right. My dear, dear friend Arenos. I think this is where I'm going to call it uh, because I'm uh, slightly over stream time, uh, which is generally not the biggest of problems. Um, but this might be uh, the next... A uh, big heavy game we're gonna get into. I think it's at least 80 hours long. I believe so, especially if I listen to all the the voice acting, which I want to do. You know, but there's tons of hours of actual voice lines, and uh, they put all their work into it. And uh, I want to listen to it. And so, um, like always, if it is a really long running um, series, we might break it up, like play play two solid weeks of it or something, and then. Uh, switch over to something else for a week and then, you know, flip flop just so we can keep things fresh as opposed to uh, people getting maybe bogged down uh, from the gameplay itself. But uh, I've been really craving like D&D &D kind of stuff, so we might be here for a while. Uh, there's other options out there available as well. Um, but other than that, hope you guys are looking forward to Saturday. I know I am. Uh, I cannot wait to continue playing some uh, D, D with our dear friends. Hi, doggy. What are you doing, doggy? Um, but yeah, I think uh, we're going to call it here. Uh, appreciate you guys hanging out. Yeah, let's see if we got anyone to raid here. Um, let's see. Uh, Rainbow Six Siege? Nah. Escape from Tarkov? Nah. Oh, Lithia's... Whoa. Excuse me, she's doing some art and guess we check that out. Uh got a lot a lot of people doing uh, art. Ooh, etc. kid might be doing some D, D stuff. He he does a lot of uh he's been doing some uh besides his improv music, he's been doing uh improv like D, &D story sessions. So maybe we'll check his channel out once the ad goes away. Um Hey, Poise is streaming. I haven't seen him stream in a while. <gasps> Lara is streaming. Okay, she's doing uh, nerd uh, pixel arts. All right, freaking longest ad ever. Oh, he has. <gasps> is that Mermaid Unicorn? No fucking way. Hold up. Hold up. Oh my god. No way. That's so cool. Why can't I fucking turn on the sound? That is all right. That's cool to see. One mermaid unicorn is going through some um, medical problems right now, so she's had to like put a delay on her streaming. She's a wonderful person. I met her at TwitchCon. Beautiful voice. D All right, you know what? Hold on. Um, and uh, she's a wonderful person, extremely talented. She can she can learn to play instruments within like a month of playing it. It's insane. Um, also, I saw lights flashing. 
You already hit the five biddies. I don't know why the alerts are broken again, but they seem to be. Um, even though the light's going off, so it knows that something's happening. Say, so take up for the biddies. But what I was saying is, etc. Kid is doing his improv music right now, and Mermaid Unicorn is there. She's making a guest appearance. Oh, this is a VOD, though. It says he's live. I'm very confused. I'm confused. Man, that's freaking cool, though. I didn't know they collabed. Uh, we can do Shy Fox. Uh, she's doing some hybrid animal art. Or we can do Lara. She's playing... She plays nerd music all the time, and it's fantastic. She's the, the one that has... Uh, what is that called? Where you see sound as color. So cool. I don't know. I'm having a hard time choosing here, guys. Have we raided, um... Shy Fox? I don't know if we have. Let's go raid Shy Fox. She's cool. She's uh, painted uh, or done some art of the doggos before. So let's go raid her. Hopefully you guys stick around. Get them puppo points. You know, so you can use them for all sorts of other goodies. But uh, thank you guys so much for tuning in to me. Uh, remember to spay new to your pet. Or wait, if you liked it, remember to like, subscribe, comment. It helps me out a lot. Let's you know what you're liking, what you're not liking. But more importantly, remember to spay new to your pets. Adopt, don't shop. Donate to a rescue if you can afford it. Or open up your house up to the possibility of fostering that is a very rewarding experience and helps those animals and rescues out. They're very much in need. Jade is over there kicking the air because she knows what time it is. But uh, thank you guys so much for tuning with me. Um, um, I am Invasive. This one is Jada's. The camera is not focusing in on them. That's it's very. Oh, it's because it's 720p on Twitch. And this one's Mamas. Thank you guys so much for tuning with me. And I'll catch you guys next time. See ya over there.